Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. Tax evasion time? Not yet. We will be going through some uh, film photos that I got back, but yeah, after that we will tax evade as we do because <laughs> I, I guess we love tax evasion. How are you doing, Sandra? Have you had dinner? Hmm. I don't know why Twitch is saying my connection is unstable, but I hope it's okay on your end. I'm doing hungry? <laughs> okay, okay. Very fair, very fair. Hopefully you'll get your dinner soon. On your end, it's fine. Okay. Yeah, I, I don't know. Maybe it's a Twitch thing, you know? Because when I hover over it, it says that my stream bitrate is too high. So I, I'm i like, what, what do you want me to do? Do you want me to not have... Okay, now it's excellent. <laughs> okay. I guess all I have to do is just curse it a little bit. Um, but yeah. Uh, today, I just, I just want to like, you know, I initially planned to go to the gym <laughs> this morning or like afternoon. And I woke up and I was like, uh, my some parts of my muscles were still aching from last week's gym session and I'm like you know what I'm gonna take it a little bit slower a little bit easier I'm not going to uh, uh, you know ex over exert myself I guess would be the right way to describe it so basically I didn't end up going to the gym which it's not exactly a good thing because I don't have any other days to replace it um i am going wednesday but yeah all of my other days are like booked so a walk yeah so, so that's that's what i did uh this morning i walked my dog and i tried to make healthier meals <laughs> keyword being tried <laughs> because <laughs> um I, I think if you if you've seen my instagram this afternoon and at night, like an hour ago, you would have seen that I tried to make uh, a, it's I guess a ramen veggie delight um, somewhat and also a pizza with a lot of different vegetables and pepperoni on it. So I'm going to show you guys a few photos because it's a little bit... <clears throat> L lunch wasn't the best, but dinner was fine. Dinner was fine. The tofu pizza, if I don't want to add water, I can pan fry the tofu before adding to the pizza. That's fair. I think I was just lazy. <laughs> so, <laughs> I, did not, I did not even bother to like uh, prep it any other ways. But let me just... So, as you can tell, this was what I got. Um, from FairPrice and uh, it's like this tofu base that's supposed to be like beauty hot pot kind of stuff uh, you the, the the lady that sold it to us she was like oh yeah you add like uh, one one to one for noodles and that is that is it you know like you don't have to worry so much about um, anything else uh, so that's what I tried but I have to say, this soup smells, and it smells so strong of like soya, soya beans and mushrooms. But the thing is, I don't know if it's not like my shiitake mushrooms that that, that 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 made it smell so bad. But but you know, I still have a bit left. I'm gonna go sniff it. <laughs> I'm gonna go sniff it and try it without shiitake mushrooms next time around. But this was basically what came out of the soup ramen thing <laughs> so I, I added a bunch of shit like so much shit like cabbage shiitake mushrooms uh pepperoni <laughs> carrots uh bell peppers and let's just say that when some people well mainly my friends uh when, when they heard that i added pepperoni in the soup base they were like what the fuck is wrong with you <laughs> and i don't know how to explain it to them but I just wanted to add some kind of meat to some kind of protein, right? Because I would have um, 
well, my veggies, I would have a bit of protein and I would have carbs from the noodles. So, you know, <laughs> did I finish the dish? Um, I actually had quite a bit. Uh, it, it was a huge, huge, huge bowl. Um, so I ended up not finishing everything, but my brother was like super on it. And he was like, give it to me, I'll finish it. So it sounds reassuring, you know? Sausage, sausage might be better. Um, possibly did not think of it because I didn't know what else I would do with the sausage uh, considering the kind of uh, ingredients I had. But actually the pepperoni flavor is not that strong in the soup. Like honestly, you cannot taste the pepperoni. And if, I, if you never saw pepperoni, you would probably never tell that there was even pepperoni in the first place. Um, but... The pepperoni itself had a lot of flavor, so, so I, I would say not a lot of it went into the soup. So, shredded chicken! Actually, yeah, I, I think any shredded chicken might be good. Um, <laughs> I can. <laughs> I am, uh, any, I'm, I'm a chef in the kitchen that's like, anything goes. You know, whatever that I see that's in my fridge, that I think maybe, maybe, <laughs> I would, I, I would just add it in. Nope, the pepperoni flavor barely clashed with the soup. I, like, the thing is, I, I just don't think the pepperoni flavor even got out into the soup. Maybe if I cooked it a lot longer, it could have ruined the soup, but not exactly. I felt like the... Let me think, the, the, the shiitake mushrooms were really strong and the bell peppers were really strong. So... So yeah, the, the rest were fine. Uh, cabbage was sweet, which is nice. Did the soup flavor go into the pepperoni? No. No. The pepperoni tastes like pepperoni, and the soup tastes like soup. So... Then I think the rest were actually pretty okay. It was just a really big pot. I think I, I, I don't really know how to gauge the amount of food that I add for like two people so I always end up making a little bit too much as you can tell this is a really really big bowl <laughs> uh, I think I think maybe what I would do next time is really just go without the shiitake mushrooms um, that that was surprisingly just strong you're hungry we are talking about food <laughs> yeah unfortunately Unfortunately, I, I'll, I'll get out of food once I talk about my dinner. But yeah, no mushrooms. I, I, it was just way too strong. And I think the bell pepper was also not something that I would have added. Because it was also really strong. Uh, it, it was very pronounced in the soup. Mushroom best? Eh, well, <laughs> that's your prerogative. I don't know. I'm, I'm not a huge mushroom fan, but I try to take a bit more mushroom. But, you know... I, I, I like it. I mm, How would I describe this? I don't like the taste of dirt that mushroom has. But I don't mind the consistency, which is the weirdest shit. Because it's... I mean, like, most people would say that the consistency of mushroom just isn't it. Like, it's it's, it's chewy, it's, it's mushy, it's kind of gross. Um, but... I don't know. I, I enjoy the texture of it, just not the taste of it. So... That's why, that's why I try to add a bit more mushrooms, but I just don't like it to overpower the entire dish. What kind of altics are those? <laughs> what? <laughs> mushrooms suck, except for their texture. That's all. That's all I have to say. The texture is something unique. Yes, I know. It's Sandra, look! <laughs> what? I'm not I'm not going against the texture of mushrooms. Like I said, I enjoy the mushroom the texture of mushrooms, and that's why I try to add it a little bit more, but I just don't like the taste of it. The taste can go sit in a dirt and like shit itself. That's kind of it. <laughs> no mushroom slender. Mm, well So the my dinner was actually, I actually kind of like it, but I still think the bell peppers were a little bit too strong. Which I'm like, ugh, it's, it's so sad because like, I do enjoy bell peppers, but it was really too... I don't know, I, I feel like maybe I should have... 
well no the thing is i say this but i know i'm not gonna do it because it's an extra step <laughs> but i should have added uh, or like cooked the bell peppers so um this um pineapples then sliced up uh pepperonis also but yeah then the sauce is basically just like pasta sauce that's it I think I should have stir fried the bell peppers a little bit, honestly. Something about something about the bell peppers when you're roasting it, it's way too it's just not it. I don't know. Pineapples and mushrooms are really good. Um if you've tried Oh actually I have an idea. What is it like Hawaiian Supreme or something? Power and Supreme, they tend to add like other vegetables inside. Well, depending on like which store you're looking at. So they sometimes also add like mushrooms, they add olives, which I don't like, so I don't get olives. But yeah. You can stir fry the mushrooms and bell peppers together. Surprisingly, I don't mind the mushrooms with the pineapples. The only thing was really the bell peppers, they, they just stuck out so much. Aaron Supreme should have mushrooms in some stores. I actually cannot remember. It's been a while since I had Aaron Supreme. I'm usually a Hawaiian person only, so... I just know... I I'm sure they have like olives and all the other... Ugh. Oh, maybe it's, it's with other meats and not the Hawaiian one. Like Pizza Hut has this Hawaiian Double Chicken Supreme. Where they literally have pineapple, chicken, bell peppers. Um, looks a little bit... No, never mind. I've got no idea. You may get rid of the earthy taste if you stir fry it. Yeah, probably. Yeah. But yeah, that's why. But I think for, for the pizzas, it was fine. Like, there was honestly no earthy taste. Um when you mix it with the pineapple. Like, if you had a bite of pineapple with a bite of mushrooms, done. You don't even have to think about it. It tastes so good. <sighs> Is that cheese? Yes. Yes. I mean, it's a, it's a, like, the, these things are cheese. On the, on the bottom. Did anyone else taste it? My brother. <laughs> I mean, I, I'm basically making food for him. Uh, since it's just the two of us. Yeah, tortilla pizza. Oh, okay. Well, technically we didn't eat this like a pizza. We just added, we just made, we just folded it and ate it like a freaking taco or burrito. <laughs> what sauce is this? Plain ass pasta sauce. Like the prego pasta sauce kind of thing. What's his verdict? Um, this was his, okay. So yesterday I made tortilla pizzas again. I made, uh, Hawaiian pizza with uh, I, I, I made Hawaiian but without the ham so I did just pineapples and mushrooms he said it was okay but he needed some meat to balance out the taste which I'm like fine and then kimchi 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 tofu was just ugh, not it way too soggy oh, absolutely not it um, and then the last one was pepperoni with mushrooms and he said it was mid like he said something about having pepperoni and mushrooms was just not it so I was like, you know what? I, I'm just I'm just gonna mix mushrooms, pineapple, pepperoni, and bell peppers together today because I cannot give a fuck. <laughs> but yeah, like at least this this way it's like best of the two options <laughs> I made yesterday. Maybe I guess. <laughs> but yeah. That's 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 kind of it. So I, I I ended up spending most of today, uh, making food, and editing. Yes, yeah. Kind of kind of nice. It was it was very chill, a very chill day. Yours, chef. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Okay, but before. Before we get into the Australia film photos, as you can tell, I I just want to do a really quick shout out to my new Discord server. I mean, it's not exactly new, but it has just officially opened. 
and I have put up the link in the socials if you do a, an exclamation socials and it's also in my about section so you can you know click in and uh, join the server <laughs> um, <laughs> you you get to hang out with cool people like Sandra babe no no hair wait no did I not save it oh my gosh okay let me just double check where is it maybe I didn't save it oh my god where is it where is it why did I not save this Custom commands. <laughs> Dang it! I thought I was doing it just now, and then I guess it's it's not. I did it wrongly. Oh, I added it to my bot timer. Oh, that's kind of dumb. <laughs> okay, that's great. You know what? This is a dry run. <laughs> This is a dry run. Um, let me check. Oh, because it's Fossa bot. Okay, give me a moment. My brain did not think through this very hard. Um, let me just. Oh, no. Let me just go in to Fossa bot and update from there. see uh, socials there we go what do i put for stream elements um my bot commands says wait where's my bot commands my bot commands join the discord community okay give me a moment let me just update this um um, 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 okay, should be fine. Socials, there we go. Join the Discord community. Are the mods allowed to edit the? No, I don't believe for Fossa bot. I have it in. Let me double check. Rules. I don't believe. Okay, let me just view keywords, manage keywords. If not, never mind. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. There we go join the discord community i might honestly remove for sub bot mm, never mind we'll see at least just have like one bot you know not have multiple bots but yeah this this should be okay okay are you having typo again for dinner sandra It's our number two mod OTing again. Number two mod. I hope it's not OTing. Yes. Sounds good. Likely traveling. Oh. That's true, that's true. I forgot. Sky OT. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness I uh, tomorrow also OT I don't okay I don't <laughs> I hope you won't be late tomorrow because that that would absolutely suck but <laughs> but yeah we'll see we'll see I mean I, I think he would be you don't trust oh my gosh <laughs> He always late lah. Okay, but not, not terrible. 
not terrible. Hmm, I don't know, but <laughs> boss Leo, that's true. That's true. Yeah, he 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 is acting like he is um <laughs> a big boss now, huh? Okay, let me do a very quick plug, and then. photos today uh, <laughs> and then see the photos here I guess there we go let's go insta people <laughs> need to take care of work cause big boss well hmm <laughs> slide show time yup let me just hydrate a little bit. But anyway, let me see. I'm gonna sh I'm gonna do like the whole slideshow and see if it. Um. Okay, I might have to readjust this because I I wanna show the entire thing. So let me just do this. Okay. There we go. So, film photos from Australia. I took these like uh, uh, July into August of 2022. It's been a while. I only just got it processed. And I brought two rolls of 36 film rolls. Yep. And. Basically, after processing it, both came back with like 29 photos each. And it's it's quite disappointing because there were quite a few photos that like I was honestly hoping to see, but it never really turned out. Chill slides, thanks. I made use of... um, <laughs> I made full use of... Uh, what is it? Like, like slides from other people. <laughs> Let me actually just adjust the, the, the chat a little bit. It's bugging me. Wait, where is this one? Oh, actually no. Wait, do I... Okay, let me just bring this down a little bit. Is this better? Oh my gosh. Let me bring it up just a little bit. I'm sorry. The, oh my goodness. The, the chat had to refresh. One, two, three. Is this better? Is this in line? Eh, it looks somewhat in line. Let me actually just adjust the... This one. Is it even moving? Wait. Is this better? Okay. Lost in memories? Yeah, lost in Yeah, exactly. So like, I feel kind of sad about some of the photos, but... I will... If I, if I recall any of the photos, I'll let you know along the way. But anyway, first set of film uh, that I got back from the film. Make note. What? The process? Hmm. You know what? Whatever. <laughs> the, the shop that I went to get my films processed. Um, it is basically all of the photos when I got on the plane to Cairns. And then all the way to like Launceston, which is in Tasmania. You might be dinner soon. No, but yeah, <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Go have your dinner when it is, you know, when, when it's ready and just come back afterwards. How long was Cairns? Cairns. Okay. So in each place, Cairns, I spent about in terms of full days. So, so. Travel day is one one day itself. So like let's say Cairns to Melbourne, I just took it as one one day gone. Um, even if it's a couple of hours of flight. But Cairns I stayed for three full days. Melbourne I stayed for five days. On Seston, I only stayed for two days before I traveled down to Hobart. So yeah. I flew into Cairns. Um it was about a five and a half hour flight. Five hours? I think so. About there. Yeah, it's it's one of the nearer um, countries to Singapore. Uh, nope, states. Cities to Singapore. Like, 
if you flew to Perth, it's about five hours. Um, but yeah, Australia is huge. And then the flight from Cairns to Melbourne took about two and a half hours or three hours. It's one of the longest flights. And then Melbourne to Launceston was like one hour because it's literally just over the ocean. It is more... Cairns is more north, up north. So I spent most of my... Well, actually, I spent all of my trip on the east side of Australia. I wanted to go to Perth, but it was a stupid-ass route that I just knew I could not get to Perth at all. And the flights were outrageous. It was... It's like... It's that kind of flight where you're like, oh, if let's say I fly to from Melbourne to Perth, it's some for whatever reason, needs to stop at Sydney before it flies off to Perth. You know, that, that kind of stupid combinations. Hello, Dubu. <laughs> welcome, welcome. Perth flights bad. Yes, exactly. So I actually didn't really get to go to Perth at all. I don't know if I'll go back just for Perth, but we'll see. But yeah, let's just get into the first set. But yeah, welcome, Dubu. We are going through the film... F photos what we're going through the photos i took in australia on a film camera it is a toy film camera um but yeah put me <laughs> i i will i guess <laughs> um the hand handle of lights yeah yeah they're probably that we traveling again maybe this year i don't know but the, the year's still really early but yeah, these are these are the Aussie photos. Okay, Sandra, have a good dinner. I'll see you later. But yeah. So for the very first set, <laughs> these were the three photos that I took. And I took this back but before I even started flying. This is by the way ISO 200. And ISO 200 are films that require a lot of light. Like, a lot of light. So you will see a lot of my photos are very underexposed. And these three photos are basically it. Hello, Kay. Welcome. We just started talking about the film photos that I took. But yeah, virtual holiday. These are literally the first three photos that I took um, in when I was still in Singapore before I flew off. And I tried to take photos of my dog, but as you can tell, there, there is no dog. <laughs> There is no dog because it, it, it was just way too dark. Um, I did not consider uh, more like bringing in light into these photos and my toy camera had no flash. So unfortunate. But the next photo was the flight over from Singapore to Cairns. Uh, obviously, I have to take the very classic flight airplane wing thing you know <laughs> but yeah i actually really enjoy this this shot quite a bit it's a uh, i like i like the the kind of vibes that you got up here oh actually you can't see my mouse but in the top right corner quite nice this was the first day in Cairns. i believe i took it right when i landed. no wait i took it on the very first morning that i got to Cairns because i landed in Cairns at night, like 7 p.m. So this was like the first morning. I woke up, I went to walk around. Um, this entire trip, I went alone. So I took a lot of tours and, and, and you'll see like, the very basic ass uh, <laughs> tourist spots later on. But this is basically Ken's. Like this is the view as I stepped out of my hostel. Really nice. Honestly, Ken's is one of my favorite places out of all of the other uh, cities that I've been to in Australia but yeah then this one again super underexposed did not think about how dark it was but this was like in the Daintree area in Cairns and oh, I tell you the Daintree area had so much forested areas and a lot of the roads were kind of like one way or like not mostly one way, like one lane each. So like two lanes, right? Is that is that the, the lingo? I don't know. <laughs> but it was like one direction and it was narrow and the roads were just covered by trees. It really felt like you were in a super forested area. 
and this was well basically the vibe like this was lunchtime but this was how little light there was so it's not bad this is let's see this is the, the very next day this is my my th second tour in Kent and it was a snorkeling tour man <laughs> I felt so awkward when I was snorkeling um I have never snorkeled I can barely swim <laughs> but I don't know why I decided to do it um it, it, you, I don't know if you guys can see at the kind of like the ocean line you sh you will see like the sailboats I ended up on a sailboat snorkeling trip and it was kind of wild and I really like it but basically you went snorkeling and then for like one hour or something and then after that you would be brought to the green island which is this like small little island and you just spend like two hours on on the island itself and then yeah it's 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 basically beach area on one side there is a resort on the island itself but you know there's not a lot to do honestly there's not a lot to do were you alone the whole trip yes uh i had no friends in australia <laughs> And I mean, it was a very impromptu trip, so I, I wasn't expecting to meet up with any friends or if any friends like, wanted to come to Australia for whatever, like, no, I was alone the entire trip. Which is actually nice. At least your friends in Singapore. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Indeed, Kay. <laughs> yeah, so more beach photos. The waters were so nice. It was so nice. But it was so hot. Which, okay, the thing is, Green Island is ironic, right? It's, it's, an, it's an island where half of it is sunny, hot, and just like beach. The other half of it is like just wind. And the trees were swaying so hard that like it felt like you were getting blown off your feet. Like everything was just like, like, like it was just like howling wind on the other side of the island and it was just so weird it was just so weird like i i i recall <laughs> i recall sitting here like in the wind for like five minutes just taking in the cold cold air but it was still really sunny so it was it's like it's like getting sunburned but at the same time you feel really cool <laughs> so yeah it was, it was really nice. It was really nice. Then this was when we were done with Green Island and we got back onto the sailboat. I don't know if you can tell, right? There's actually a lot going on in this photo, but you can... If, if, if you notice a little bit more, right? You'll notice that the ocean looks a little slanted. And that is the whole, like, attraction to this sailboat um, experience where on the way back to Cairns you are literally sitting slanted in the waters this photo is nice thank you this is one of my favourite photos as well I thought the waves are crashing yes so like there were so many times and, and that's why they had the blinds or something drawn down on, on the side behind the captain um, there was literally waves crashing in um, hitting the seats which is behind him absolutely wow like you are sitting 45 degrees and you had to prop your feet up on the table in front of you just so that you don't <laughs> just so that you don't slip off like that's that's how steep it felt but yeah so but the reason why I took this photo was because of the centerpiece <laughs> if you notice the zip ties <laughs> Q in Titanic soundtrack <laughs> oh no I'm glad I'm glad uh, it was all okay but the zip ties so what happened was this machine that's on the steel handle it came off uh, halfway through the journey and then everyone including the captain they were all like okay let's take some zip ties let's just tie it back <laughs> let's just let's tie the entire thing back <laughs> And I was like, what the heck? It is. It's it's really funny. Like honestly, seeing everyone work together on this ship, um, it's 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 actually really nice. Like the captain, which is the guy in the in this photo, 
is really nice and all of his crew are just so nice. I honestly think Australia impresses me in terms of like their tourist, their tourism, in terms of like the people that work in the tourism industry. There is a lot of respect when it comes to like the env- like the nature of their work talking about the environment depending on what tours you're on and just like having a lot of respect for their history and I was just so impressed by almost every single tour guide that I met being in that boat where I've sent my nervous system into overdrive you would not be the only one <laughs> there was oh I, I think I think you it should be this guy so if you see right behind the captain there's this like mountain of blanket um, let's just say that uh, two, two people felt so sick, like so, so seasick that they had to lie down. And even then, um, <laughs> he painted. <laughs> yes, essentially. <laughs> essentially, he painted. Like, they just, they just couldn't stand it. It was, it was just way too, way too rocky, way too uneven. So, I completely understand. But yeah, you, you wouldn't be the only one, so... <laughs> yeah. Then, this is Cairns again. This is uh, the Ferris wheel that's right outside my hostel, as you can tell. I was dumb thinking that I can take photos of the sunset, but <laughs> ISO 200. But at least, this, this, this was kind of nice, right? The Ferris wheel looked kind of nice, I think, maybe. I don't know. <laughs> This was the last day that I had in Cairns. So I had three full days in Cairns. And this was the day that I flew out of Cairns to Melbourne. And yeah, you could kind of basically see... I, I, I took the first photo around here. Uh, the Ferris wheel was on the left. And then... Yeah. This, this is literally Cairns. Like, the main attraction of Cairns is right along the coastline. And a lot of the other things around it are either too far or just suburban. So I honestly think that's why I enjoyed Cairns quite a bit. Because it's just very chill. It's a very different pace of life compared to Singapore. And the kind of warmth that the people had there for like the in, in the service industry, in the tourist tourism industry, it was so nice. I really enjoyed Cairns. Special place in my heart, for sure. Then we fly into Melbourne. It's a very random ass shot. I can't even remember when I took this, to be very honest. But it's, it's very Melbourne. <laughs> <laughs> then uh, this is Yara Valley, I think. Feeling, I can't hear anything, but I love the film grain and film photography. Nice. Are you on the way home? Please transcribe. <laughs> We will, we will transcribe for you, yes. Um, uh-huh. <laughs> okay, but back to this photo. This was, uh, where did I say? Yara Valley? Was it Yara Valley? I think it was Yara Valley. Um, when I was in Australia, I wanted to go on a wine tour. And Dubu, I, I followed it to real time transcribing. Yep. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> Um, and okay, the thing is, right, I am not a big drinker for a fee of $50 an hour. Jesus, do <laughs> That's not volunteering. <laughs> um, okay, let me think. Okay, I cannot take my alcohol well. I have alcohol intolerance and I do break out in hives. <laughs> How about you get bent? Feel like, oh my god. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> okay, this, this chat is getting a little bit wild. <laughs> but yeah, so I don't know why I, I signed up for two wine tours. Um, <laughs> okay, I'm out to see you, okay? Bye, feline. Um, but yeah, this was one of the, the photos at the wine wineries, vineyards. Yeah, that's it, I think. <laughs> Next one. If you've been to uh, Melbourne, the Brighton Beach boxes, not too bad. At least there wasn't an 8% GST charge. <laughs> oh 
Oh my goodness, you guys. Um, yeah, I mean, if you don't know about the Brighton Beach boxes, it's basically very expensive boxes that rich people buy so that they can put their beach equipment next to the beach. And then they just go to their boxes, take it out, and then they just hang out on the beach. Yeah, that's kind of it. <laughs> I think if I if I recall correctly, this one, like this box right here, should be the most expensive box that's sold for either six hundred thousand or one point two million. I can't remember which one, but um, <laughs> you know what? <laughs> yeah, this is kind of nice. I met a really nice um lady on this tour. She. She was studying, well, not worse, she is studying like medicine in one of the local universities and she was like so into uh, the sanctuary, which is what we went to after the Brighton Beach Boxes. And we tried to feed the damn kangaroos. As you can tell, the feed is on the ground and we just got so... <laughs> <laughs> we got so annoyed because they were just not eating because it was like mid-afternoon so a lot of them were like sleeping I think you can kind of tell in the distance they were just so far away <sighs> I, I'm just like <laughs> okay we, we, we felt we felt really annoyed <laughs> but still kind of cute and they kind of blended in they were like kangaroos and the other variations of kangaroos that are smaller that I cannot remember what they're called. Oh my god. <laughs> but it's not it's not like the babies, it's another type of marsupial. Just that it's smaller than a kangaroo. You know what? I don't know. We'll get there. <laughs> then this one. Oh my goodness. This is a photo of my tour guide in Melbourne. And because I took like um, tours in Melbourne for three days. All three days, I went for the same tour agency and I met him in my first tour day, which was uh, a wine tour. And then I met him again on my Great Ocean Road uh, tour. And I was like, I'm going to take a photo of you. And as you can tell, super underexposed. <laughs> but I guess you can somewhat tell the features <laughs> good enough. Um... I don't know if the top left corner is an issue with uh, me accidentally exposing the film to light. Uh, could be. We will see. I can't remember. But <laughs> <laughs> this one is, I mean, of course, if you've seen it, Twelve Apostles, it's quite nice. It was surprisingly not that crowded. But yeah, there wasn't a lot to do. Like there was this other walkway or like this other angle of the Twelve Apostles uh, but it was in just like getting fixed up or something so I, I didn't really I didn't I didn't really get to go there but there wasn't a lot to do except to just take photos <laughs> <laughs> um, even more of these kinds of shots there was just a lot of nature and scenery I liked it and then this was the shot of my Let's see, Th this was the city skyline shot right outside my single room hostel. Yeah. Is this how I'm going to describe it? That's, that's, that's so fucking weird. A private room. So like, I got a private room on the very last night of Melbourne. Um, before that in Cairns and the first few days of Melbourne, I had a shared room. So, so shared rooms, I mean like, you know, you can kind of think bunk beds, all that kind of stuff. Um, so this is my first private room of the entire trip. And it's actually really nice. As you can tell, it was at like the, the 17th floor or something. It was super high and had a really nice view. But the, the sad thing was that there was no like private toilet. So it's, it, was, it was still a shared toilet. But for the view, not, not terrible at all. <laughs> I will say that um, there was a photo in between that somehow got lost and I'm kind of annoyed because like over here it's Launceston completely other place in Australia and Tasmania but I met really nice ladies in the Melbourne hostel when I was sharing a room and we took a photo on my film camera 
in between these two shots, gone. I don't know where it is and I'm very disappointed because <laughs> I think that was, I think we had one more digital photo, but it's, it's, it's such a shame. <sighs> but yeah, anyway. <laughs> the next part of my trip was flying to Tasmania. Um, so in Melbourne, early in the morning, I took like a 7 or 8 a.m. flight out to Launceston, uh, Hobart. Uh, Launceston, Tasmania, sorry. And then, um, yeah, I actually only had two days in Launceston. And the first day I had, a, I, I technically booked two days of tours, but then one of the tours got cancelled. And so I had to come up with a plan pretty last minute. Um, but I mean, I guess that that's why you, that's why it's quite enjoyable being on your own sometimes because you just go and do whatever you want, you know? Um, when I was, when I was in Launceston, I was like, there is this place called the Cataract Gorge and it's very near the, 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 the hostel that I was living in. Actually, it was really, really near. It was like a seven to 10 minutes walk at best. And yeah, when you got to the entrance of Cataract Gorge, it was maybe another 20 minutes walk into this area. And where I took this photo was the cafe that uh, they had. And I really liked it. It was such a beautiful day, honestly. Um, as you can tell, bottom of the photo, like exposure <laughs> i messed up the whole um trying to wind my film back process and i opened up my 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 camera my film camera and so a bit of light got in <laughs> a bit <laughs> uh, quite a bit of light actually hello sandra welcome back but yeah what's this this is a photo in launceston tasmania uh it's it's in a place called Cataract Gorge and it's about a 30, 35 minutes walk from my hostel back then. Um, and yeah, it was it was a very last minute planned thing because my tour got cancelled last minute. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to go do this. So yeah, then I think, dang. See, the thing is, right, I have this in the same set of photos, but... Oh, actually, you know what, I think maybe I, I got, um... I, made, I messed up the order of it, but let me start with this one first. So this was the journey to Hobart. So, because you're in Tasmania, you can basically just take a bus down from Launceston to Hobart. But, strangely enough, there is no flight out of Launceston to like Sydney or Melbourne and it's only in Hobart. Are those my fingers? Probably. Honestly, probably. But yeah, the bus ride down to Hobart was about an hour and a half. It was quite nice. It was very chill. A lot of wide open fields, a lot of cows, sheep, all that. I was literally like cow spotting, sheep spotting the entire time. <laughs> I absolutely enjoyed it. Um, yeah. But... These two photos, and I, I think you can kind of already see just how much light damage um, happened to these photos. But if I'm not wrong, these two photos should be um, in Hobart on a tour um, coming back from... What is... Why do I keep forgetting the island's name? I have such a terrible experience with that island. <laughs> Bruni Island called Booney Island. How does a photo get light damaged? So a film photo gets light damaged when you expose the film to light um, before it's meant to be processed. So this means like um, maybe you opened up your camera, you, know, you open up your film camera uh, when, it, when it isn't rolled into its shell. But yeah. So these two should be the fairy right bag bag back from Bruni Island to Hobart and the reason why I blanked out Bruni Island so much was because the only thing that I really enjoyed about Bruni Island were the oysters and like that's it 
I <laughs> I essentially met one of the most meh tour guides on this tour, Bruni. So like B R U N Y. Um, he you could tell that he was just in it for the the money. Like he had no heart. He just brought us to a lot of like the shops and just left us there. You know, um, not not as passionate as like a lot of the other tour guides that I've met. But I mean, I don't know. Maybe it's maybe it's just him. Maybe it's just him. Um, but yeah. And another thing was that I lost my wallet <laughs> on the way back from Bruni Island. Uh, <laughs> it's so dumb. Like I honestly think that I dropped it on the ferry, and I just had no time. Like, yeah, I had no time to go back to the ferry area to get it back. Yeah, it is this place. Mm -hmm. So I essentially lost my card a bit of cash and my room key which is such a shame like it's honestly such a shame but yeah then the next set which actually technically a couple of photos were already in Hobart but set 2 was only Hobart and Sydney card yes my U-trip card so <laughs> I I, I bring a lot of my credit cards. I, I think I brought like three credit cards in different spots on myself uh, out to Australia because I know that they are very card friendly and I didn't really want to carry a lot of cash. Uh, so I tried... Well, I thankfully used my U-trip for like a good three quarters of my journey in Australia. So I, I was like totally fine. One, like given that I had like one quarter of my trip and I didn't have my card so I was like you know what it's fine it's fine but yeah Hobart is also one of my favourite places in Australia it is so quaint and so relaxing but it's still city-ish enough so you have like malls you have like the restaurants that, that you would see a bit more townish um, a bit more, uh, like just, just a bit more things to do compared to Cairns. But Cairns is like really the kind of like seaside town. It's very tranquil. There's not a lot to do, and the only mall, and there's only like one mall there. And like that's it. But yeah. So you lost your cut when you're reaching the end of the trip. Yes, correct. Yeah, but Hobart, Hobart's just beautiful. Hobart is also next to the sea. But it had a lot more, a uh, couple more malls, a couple more like uh, bigger retailers, so you won't feel that bored. But yeah, Hobart is beautiful. So, <laughs> this photo was on one of my tours in Hobart, one of my other tours in Hobart, and we were basically just like chasing waterfalls. Um, this one is like again super underexposed because it was relatively dark even though it was about 10 11 a.m but the, the area is just pretty forested so that's why it's kind of dark what's in their malls is it like is it like sh is it like sh it's their malls are like slightly smaller two-story three-story kind of malls they have like of course like food uh, bookstores some of like their own uh, own brands, Australian started brands. Um, of course, the, the big supermarkets that you'll be familiar with. But yeah, it's 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 a it's, it's quite a nice place. Are the malls also replicas of each other? Yeah, some some of them were, some of them were. Um, it really depends. In Hobart, I felt like it was unique enough. In Sydney and Melbourne, definitely felt like replicas of each other. Like, yeah, like you said, McDonald's, Uniqlo, a lot of very similar shops in different malls that are like a couple of walks away from each other. <laughs> but yeah, Ho Hobart was a lot more different. Hobart and Cairns was a lot more different. This one. This was, I mean, as you can tell, hopefully, it's a guitar and... If you can tell, there is this like little block of something on the guitar and you can see like wires kind of like trailing along the guitar. So this was um, 
there was this guy that we met uh, in this area right next to the waterfall and he had this setup and all these wires were linked to his laptop and his laptop was basically playing songs and these like modules on the guitar were strumming the guitar like automated strumming and it was really cool um, it was really tranquil really relaxing I think he had like a camera somewhere on the right side also just like pointing towards the guitar and the uh, waterfall and then after that we went to oh my god actually the Tasmanian devil this had to be the weirdest animal that I saw there only in terms of the sound that it makes only in terms of the sound that it makes like oh a big <laughs> like this it had a very guttural screaming voice and the Tasmanian devil isn't it's partially blind so you know like like you don't you don't have to worry so much about uh, it seeing you but it can grab onto you with its jaws and it can chew through bones a bear pig yes so you know just 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 be careful but it had like the weirdest guttural sounds ever when it makes when, when, it, when it calls out so <laughs> i actually really enjoyed looking at Tasmanian devil quite a bit and then let me think so this one was also part of the same tour, same like the the waterfall, the Tasmanian Devil, and then this this is like I don't know, <laughs> I don't know why this is part of the tour, because like the tour guide was like, oh yeah, this is this the 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 town that I grew up in, and we're gonna stop here for lunch for like one and a half hours, and I was like, o okay, <laughs> like that's it, it's it's literally so it's literally like shops um buildings i guess along the road and they are all owned by the people that live there and yeah this was just one of the monumental uh bridges that were in the town itself if i'm not wrong it's like a hundred years when we a hundred years 200 years i think it's like 200 years years old maybe i think some of it it's, it's one of a very rounded uh, years but yeah I, I did spend my I did spend quite a bit of time just like being here and just like looking at people and this one this one was right outside a candy chocolate ice cream shop that sold one of my most favorite ice creams in Hobart if you ever go to Hobart you have to go to the Van Diamond Lens Creamery it is just so good and as I sat outside eating my ice cream, I saw this cute ass dog. So of course, I had to take a photo. Because why wouldn't I take a photo of a cute ass dog? <laughs> but yeah, um, that's, that's kind of it. <laughs> that's the entire photo. Oh, okay. And then I, I believe this is the last part of the entire tour. We climbed up to... Well, climbed up. <laughs> we took <laughs> the bus. <laughs> up to uh, the top of the mountain uh, what mountain is this again? let me think Mount Wellington yeah Mount Wellington it's one of their biggest uh, mountains there my bottom wall like smudged it's, it's my finger again I th it's definitely my finger <laughs> and I tell you at the top of this freaking mountain it was so fucking cold the winds so harsh it was like negative one negative two degrees celsius i don't know how people can stand anything lower than that but oh my god i was like freezing my ass off and um i i felt like i was getting whipped by the cold air when i was there like literally my face turned super red and, um I, I was trying so hard to keep warm <laughs> Do you wear appropriate gear i tried but apparently i was not prepared at all <laughs> i was completely not prepared like i had on uh innerwear i had on uh, a sweater i had on a what is it like a, a third layer like another sweater kind of thing a puffy jacket a 
what I have? Uh, a windbreaker. So I had about five layers and I was still fucking cold. It was just so tough. Singaporeans are not cold resistant. Exactly. Exactly. Like, I was just freezing my ass off when I was there. And, oh, the interesting thing was, the same guy that we met at the very beginning of the entire tour, the guy who who, who basically had this, like, whole guitar set up, he was also up on the mountains doing the exact same thing at the exact same time that we were there. And I was just so impressed. Because, like, he must have had to freeze his ass off just trying to get that video up but yeah the smart robotic guitar it was so cool following my tour <laughs> maybe honestly maybe <laughs> but yeah it, it, was, it was very impressive so you can kind of see the entire town of hobart down there and i mean of course you can see it in every direction but um when you're up on the freaking mountains but um let me think let me try and reorganize myself so if i'm not wrong this part if it's my mouse yeah this part was where i lived uh in hobart if i'm not wrong the airport is this thing if i'm not wrong it's this area so it's like across the river uh, across the river you had to cross a bridge basically and then if you looked somewhere uh, well there was this like very cool art museum all the way to the left i don't think it's this one i think it's maybe further down but yeah, you can kind of see the kind of layout. And then if you took a bus down from Launceston to Hobart, you kind of took this like general route down to the heart of Hobart. The river got boat services. Yes. Yes, there were actually quite a few. Um but yeah. Then this one was a photo that I took. Um are there any foot pics of your girls? <laughs> There are no food pigs, and unfortunately, there are still no cute girls. <laughs> I'm sorry to disappoint you, Dubu. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't take food pigs with my film camera, cause I don't know. I don't know why I didn't. But yeah, I I initially took photos of cute girls, but they didn't get processed. So it's one of those things. Um, <laughs> but yeah, anyway, this photo, so this was actually Mount Wellington, if I'm not wrong, according to my homestay owner. And I was uh, kind of just out on the balcony because I got a private room for my trip in Hobart. And oh my goodness, this homestay guy was just so sweet. Like he runs the entire house and he has like a bunch of like bunk rooms, a bunch of private rooms. And like I said, right, I, I lost my, I lost my keys to the room um, on the trip back from Bruni. And I went down to him the very next day and I told him in, the, in his kitchen, basically, I said, hey, look, I'm sorry, I lost a key. Can I do something to like repay? And he was so, so nice about it. He was like, you don't have to do it. Thank you for being honest. Um, I'm really glad that you did uh, admit it because a lot of people don't. Um, so you don't have to pay for anything. And I was like, what the heck? He is so freaking sweet. He is so nice. Let me see. I should do a shout out. Um, what is it called? Let me see. Accommodations. Actually, honestly, I feel like if you... He is a very, very popular um, homestay owner. He is around Battery Point, which is one of the key um, sites of uh, Hobart. Just that it is a little bit far away from like uh, the public transport. <laughs> from the public transport. I think, I think it's like... So, da -ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. Um, he's like, um, he... Oh, this one, Montecute Boutique. So I don't, let's see, should I? Okay, I'm gonna out. I'm gonna show you guys this, but yeah, Montecute Boutique. If you ever are in Hobart, Landlord? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. 
it's quite a quaint place, like two stories as you can tell up here. Um, he has the open garden outside. Um, but yeah, so like there's a lot of uh, rooms with bunk beds, uh, private rooms and all that. And it's situated right above Salamanca Market. So it's, it's pretty convenient, I will say. And uh, yeah, the owner is just really, really nice. It feels like a hotel realm. Not as fancy as some of the hotels, I think, but definitely like quaint enough. So if you ever, ever that, uh, Montecute Boutique Bunkhouse. Landlord doesn't feel like hotel realm. <laughs> I honestly think this is more of like a, like he bought the house and he just renovated it. So it's, it's kind of, eh, I don't know. But yeah. Slideshow. So, this was basically the view that I got uh, outside of my window on the second floor. And then this one, again, super underexposed, if you can tell. There's a little pug over here. This is the owner's dog, one of the two dogs that he owns. And for some reason, this pug was just barking. <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, I, I I I just stood over the balcony and I just took a photo of him. I actually think I can't remember what 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 the angle was. I don't recall if this was like stairs or something because I was on the second floor. But dog wants you to go pet. He looks really fierce. <laughs> I didn't I didn't dare. <laughs> I didn't absolutely dare. But but there there were some 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 ladies downstairs that did play with him a little bit so yeah maybe right what what if the dog does want to chew my head <laughs> but yeah so that was like Hobart I absolutely loved Hobart Hobart's one of my favorite places and it's one of the few places that actually no I, I I'll honestly say gen generally throughout all of the places that I've gone to all of them feel very comfortable to walk around even at night alone um, but Hobart was just like special because there were just things to do and that was my favourite ice cream shop and I had ice cream every night. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely one of, one of my favourite places, Hobart and Kent's. This. So after Hobart, uh, in my very last leg of my Australia trip, Sydney. Sydney is... My god, I don't know if it's because I was tired by the entire trip of like having to travel. Um, but Sydney was just lukewarm throughout the entire thing. Like the tour guides were really nice, but I rarely went on tours because Sydney was okay to have... No, actually no, I only went for on two tours in Sydney. A wine tour and a tour that went out into the Blue Mountains. And the wine tour was fine. The wine tour was actually really nice. Um, the Blue Mountains tour was just... <laughs> it's just weird. <laughs> Sydney is absolutely like a mini SG. Um, like, I would say that service and tourist, tourism wise, it's not as friendly and as like warm and welcoming compared to the other places. But you know what? You know what? It's fine. So this was basically a photo that I took. Um, after landing in Sydney and I was like looking around for like food and for like something to drink and all that and of course I had to take the very classic uh, Sydney Opera House and the Sydney Harbour Bridge kind of photo um, but I eventually went to a better spot I don't know <laughs> somewhat of a better spot um, Opera House and the Harbour Bridge again um, the good thing I I think for this particular place was that I was living in a hostel that was right next to the Sydney Harbour Bridge. Um, the only thing was that it was just a pain in the ass to get to. Like it was just stairs everywhere. And if you wanted to avoid stairs, you had to know how to walk there to avoid stairs. But it's a long, long route, a much longer route. But yeah, this was... Um, an attempt at a sunset. It was a very beautiful sunset, but as you can tell, I thought that um, my film camera with an ISO 200 can capture a fucking sunset. But 
You can kind of see a bit of orange in the sunset. And then you can kind of see the Sydney Opera House. But yeah, this was taken right on the rooftop of my hostel. Um, I stayed in the Sydney Harbour YHA. And I don't know. Like, apart from how difficult it is to get there, um, especially if you have like luggage, it's fine, you know? It's it's not it's not the best, it's not the worst. The the bed definitely felt like flat, not comfortable. But given that I was there for like three nights, it was fine. Um this was me going on the Blue Mountains tour. So a lot of like nature shots, very beautiful, beautiful scenes. Um this was again another attempt at taking a photo of a sunset. <laughs> I think this was at the three sisters. Which is just kind of dumb because like like you can barely see anything, but I just really wanted to try. <laughs> I just really wanted to try. Super underexposed, obviously, because it's you know sun setting and all that, but yeah. Then this one, I think it's also another one of the three sisters uh, photo at night. It's it's terrible. You can you can barely make it out like the the shapes. So yeah. It's okay, we we know now. Yep, that's true, that's true. But this, this is actually one of my favourite photos, like unexpectedly one of my favourite photos because of like the whole composition. It's a little bit slanted, but, but, um, let me think, I was on the way, it was one of my free days in Sydney, and I was on the way to the, what is it, like the Sydney Fish Market or something? 15 kilometers an hour, I believe so. Yes, because it's a, a tram. A light, light rail? Yeah. Um, this was a couple of days after um, my, two t my two initial first tour days. And I stupidly booked a private room in a wrong YHA. Uh, you thought it was a bus going at 15 kilometers per hour. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. Um, I don't think buses can go through here. Actually, uh, I could be wrong, but I don't believe any vehicles can pass through here except for like this this route, except for the light rail because of the tracks. Um, but yeah, I still really booked the wrong YHA for a private room. Um, I ended up booking one in Sydney Central instead of Sydney Harbour where I was. But you know what? I'm, I'm kind of... Uh, should I say that I'm thankful? I don't know. It was definitely a lot easier to get home. <laughs> um, get home to the hostel and also home to Singapore. Uh, simply because of like the proximity to a lot of um, lines. Let me see. I'm, I'm just going to skip ahead, but... Oh yeah, yeah. so like... This was one of the light reels that you immediately saw stepping out of uh, Sydney Central YHA. Very convenient. The only thing is, they don't have a convenient enough luggage storage system because you had to haul your freaking luggage upstairs just so they can store your luggage. But the only but the good thing is that they don't charge you for like the first four hours, um, unlike. Sydney Harbour YHA, which just charges you like four dollars an hour, regardless. Ugh, it's just dumb. Looks like I I time travel. It looks so old. Yeah, that's why I love it. I think this composition is fine. The thing is that I I, I think I was expecting a bit more light because you know there's there's a lot of light here, but I guess I should have composed this slightly better. What's YHA? It is a youth hostel. Uh, I mean it's an association for hostels and they basically uh, put themselves under YHA like Sydney Central Sydney Harbour they put themselves under YHA but yeah going back going back so so what happened so after this in this day itself I went to the Sydney fish market and also I went over to Manly Beach to walk the coastline yeah I walked the coastline, so it was basically just me going around, walking like crazy. I spent about half a day just walking, and over here it's like one of this like um, war memorial thing, and you could look over to another another beachfront. I can't remember what's this beachfront. 
the tree looked white with the orange thing. <laughs> this was accidental light exposure. <laughs> it was definitely ex accidental light exposure. Like as long as you see all of these like uh, orangey bright lights that clearly looks very unnatural, um, it's it's accidental light exposure. But yeah, it's quite a shame because I I felt like this was nice. Like genuinely, if there's lesser of this, I still think it would have looked nice. But you know what? It's fine. It's fine. This, this is not bad. This is not bad. Oh, but this is one of my... This is... I hated walking this path because this was like 2.4 kilometers. So about a 30 minutes walk with nothing else beside it except for a road that's barely even a walking pavement. I think I was just not... <laughs> It's just one of those days where you don't really spend a lot of time to do your research <laughs> and you just follow, like, like you just walk freely, you know, and you follow the path and that, that's where you end up, along the road. <laughs> it is like a Napa test, like seriously, I walked through, had to go through the entire stretch in order to get out into the main road. Waste of my time because there was nothing to look at, absolutely nothing to look at. But yeah. Then this one, oh, look at look at the freaking light exposure. This I am so triggered by this. <laughs> was it very hot? Um, not terrible, not terrible. It was sunny. It was not humid. A little bit dry because it was like winter for them, but it was quite comfortable, mild weather. Just sunny. It looks like a nice filter. That's fair, that's fair. This one was towards the end of the entire walk. Um, yeah, I just, yeah. With comfy stu- Yep, exactly, it's super comfy. Uh, but yeah, this was, this was the very last beach that I reached before I took the ferry back to Circular Key. Yeah. And then, um, this was, uh, again, e even more like exposure, but this is one of the super popular, like, Sydney Emperor, whatever. I can't remember what it's called. Emperor Puffs? But, I, yep, Emperor Puffs. Like, it is a couple of cents a piece, and they sold it, like, in box of five and ten, I think. And when I saw that there was a queue, I was like, Yes, I'm going to go queue. <laughs> and I got some. Hello, Hale. Welcome, welcome. We are actually going through some of the film photos I took in Australia last year. But yeah. Mian bao tang gao. Yes. Chu ru, I think. So it's like hot and fresh, if I'm not wrong. So let's see. I don't know if you guys have seen this. I, I honestly think it's very mid. <laughs> it's very mid. Um, but it's kind of like this. So so it's like... I think it's also around this price. It's honestly not bad. It's really quite decent. Yeah, Tsuru. So freshly baked bread, egg tart and all that. And I got it in like one packet. Um, it's mid mainly because... I was expecting it to be like crispy on the outside, but it's like it's more of like a soft, um, doughy kind of a consistency. But the cream inside was nice. Yeah, it felt very much like a. It, it, I mean, it basically looks like this. Reminds me of the SG snack. What SG snack? It's a little bit like Jollibee or um, not Jollibee. Oh my god, Jolly Bean or Mr. Bean's pancakes. If you have ever tried them, so it's it's kind of very. It's like soft. It's kind of like this soft, chewy, doughy consistency with cream inside. I was expecting it to be crispier, that's all. So I was like, you know what, it's fine, it's fine. <laughs> like I could have Mr. Bean at home. <laughs> it's fine, it's fine. But yeah. So that's that's kind of what I was doing uh, with this. I don't know why I decided to take it at this angle, but clearly. <laughs> I was in a rush. Um, 
and then yeah we've looked at this photo before so there's the light reel right outside my YHA and then this was my very last day in Sydney uh, I, I I had no plans I just I was like you know what let me go find like an art event fair market that was relatively near to my place um, and I just went there and I just walked around the area yeah fluffy like it, the weather was so good on my very last day the, the clouds were so fluffy sky was so blue the the sun was shining but it was not like hot hot it was nice it was honestly very nice and I took a bunch of photos that basically I <laughs> I tried. <laughs> Light exposure. <laughs> As you can tell. Which side of the car? Uh, right side? It should be... The same as Singapore. Yes. Then... Yeah, so I, I basically try to take a couple more shots, but... The light exposure in these two photos were just not it but this it was actually really nice this was one of the like hidden ish lanes that i went down and i was like you know what i'll just go and explore quite nice i actually really i don't hmm, i don't know why this one did not get as much light exposure as the other two did but i'm glad i'm glad this was nice but yeah that is it that is it. Oh my god, we're done. Well, I mean, there were a couple of photos that were missing, but it's okay. I don't know where I'll go in 2023, but we shall see. <laughs> if only actually has aesthetics. I feel like because we have lived in Singapore for so long and Singapore is so small, we tend to take a lot of things for granted. And we don't really appreciate Singapore from a tourist point of view. So, yeah. Like, I, I do think that Singapore has a certain level of aesthetics if you look for it. Yeah. But yeah. I don't know where I'll go, but this is it. This is all of my film photos. Uh, how many photos is this? 29 times 2? 58. 58. That's actually not too bad. I fucked up three at the beginning and that's it. Well, uh, that's it, but like, <laughs> I did fuck up a bit more, but you're saying about with zebra crossing? <laughs> sure, that's fair. Do they decent? Yeah, I think I, I think the next time around that I do uh, travel and bring a film camera, I might just do a disposable one. I don't know. I've had a lot better luck with disposable cameras simply because like you're not um, you're not rewinding the film back into its canister. So it's less error prone in that sense and you don't open up the disposable camera. So yeah. So disposable camera, it's pretty basic. You get the camera and you can immediately start shooting. Um, you will still have to wind the, 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 the film roll like every other film camera does, but you are basically just point, shoot, point, shoot. Then once you're done, you send it to the like whoever that, that will process your film, and then they'll just do the same magic um, for you. But when it comes to either a proper film camera or a toy film camera, you have to buy your own film. Yeah, your own film rolls. So the problem then would be like, you have to put in your film rolls, you have to wind it properly. And then once you're done, so yeah, you're shooting, you're rolling the film, you're shooting, you're rolling. Once it's done, you will have to roll back the film into the canister. And I would think that rolling back the film is the part that could cause a lot of issues because you might be like the tension and everything you might end up tearing your film which I think is honestly what happened to my to to, to, to the last few shots in my uh, two rolls disposable is the film type difference it's how you work it like at the core of it the 
the rules are the same. Uh, the rules are the same. The the build of it is just different. The way that you use it is just different. Disposable cameras are disposable for a reason because it's just very easy. Once you're done, you throw away the entire thing. There's no reusability at all. You can't even you can't even like replace your film and whatsoever. You can't you can't try different films with it unless your disposable film camera has different films inside of it. But yeah, like film cameras and film, it's interesting, but I, I realize I don't know enough to get super deep into it. Just enough to like have fun, you know? But yeah, I, I think next time around, if I do, it's definitely a disposable camera. Maybe something like a, a Fuji film disposable camera which i got last time and i had a lot better luck with it so if you don't know what i'm talking about it's basically wait let's see it's basically these things yeah it's basically these things so they're like iso 400 usually so you just take it out of the bag and then you just shoot and they actually they have like flash which is like nice so you know what Tax evasion time? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't get caught. But yeah, if you guys have any questions, you know, feel free to drop it. Um, but since my friends are here, hello. Um, the Discord server is open live. If you'd like to join the Discord server, you can uh, do so. Um, <laughs> I, I see that some of you guys have already joined. Welcome in, welcome in. But yeah. <laughs> it's in socials. There we go. I'm not allowed to hold a film camera anymore. <laughs> Why? <laughs> but I would, I would 100% get the disposable one. But yeah. Yeah, thank you, thank you for the, for uh, plugging the socials, Sandra. I hope that you guys would like the Discord channel and the setup. Feel free to interact, um, introduce yourself, uh, get inside general chat. There's even a show and tell text channel that you can post whatever. And if you want to promote yourself, go ahead. It's it's all there. It's all there. Uh oh, Dubu. <laughs> Show and tell, yeah. It's a it's a text channel in, in Discord. <laughs> so if anyone you know wants to show a photo of your pet, if there's art that you want to show, if there is anything, like honestly, you know, go ahead, do that, have fun. My IG shots are better. <laughs> Okay, thanks, Dubu. <laughs> Puyo propaganda. You can do it in the games channel. Yeah, you can do that in the games channel. You can you can start a uh, a thread for people who would like to join in on the Puyo propaganda. <laughs> but yeah, thank you for joining the Discord, guys. Hopefully, uh, you know it is interesting enough to keep you guys a little bit engaged, but. <laughs> we'll see my brain there is a schedule that I've put inside discord that would be the most accurate schedule <laughs> please do not follow my twitch schedule because it's kind of whack <laughs> but yeah you can find the stream schedule in the seb and all that category and yeah let's basically take a look uh, I will be streaming for three more days so Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And I've not decided on whether I'll stream during Chinese New Year. Very likely no, but I'll keep updates of the schedule on Discord. <laughs> Why are you laughing, Dubu? <laughs> what do you mean? Is it not a chill channel? <laughs> okay, hydrate up, guys. We are going to evade Texas in the next section of the stream. So, <laughs> if you have not heard or if you have not seen the 
Tunnet Boy commits tax evasion game. That's what we're gonna play. <coughs> I've technically finished it, but there is an extended map that I wanna go look at. And apparently there are ways that you can um, collect more hats. So we're also gonna go take a look at that. But yeah, let me just open up the game and then we will <laughs> commit some tax evasion. <laughs> Okay, let me change Is this. Yes, Tonic Boy commits tax evasion. I'm going to stop my Spotify. Okay. okay. Hey, I was listening to good tunes. This is better tunes, feline. <laughs> Wait, can you guys hear it? Yes, you guys can, right? Let me actually see. I think I should be able to hear it. Please let me know if you can't hear the game. Last place more than that. <laughs> okay, let me move back some stuff. Should be fine. Anyway, you guys will let me know if you guys can't hear it. So, let's just get into the game. <gasps> Look at this. We're bald. <laughs> We're absolutely bald. Okay. So, one thing that I was reading... <laughs> okay, this is a little bit loud. If it's too loud, please let me know. Um, hats. You can find hats in the freaking mailbox which I've never interacted before but okay there's a luminous line ticket I, I feel like there's a quest that I completely skipped over but we'll get there <laughs> there's a valve also a quest piece that I think I completely skip over but cat ears you have freaking cat ears you have a knife hat <laughs> like what the heck there's so many freaking hats. There's a turkey hat. There's an elf hat. <laughs> There's bunny ears. Like, do you see what I mean? There's so many hats. And then the shredded text papers hat. I I, I don't know how that works, but <laughs> There's a birthday cake hat. <laughs> I think that's it. There we go. Bunny hat. Bunny ears for bunny ear. Let's go. No, there's a cat. Eh, can I not wear it? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's so cute! It's so freaking cute! Okay, I don't know what's this. Onion. Only where a shovel can break through these fortifications, I bet you. Wait, did I not do this already? Yes, I know you took it. <laughs> you know what? I, I feel like I'm missing something. <laughs> it's like two swords sticking out of your head. Yeah. Okay, there are two spots in the extended one. One is down here. I think I give you a chance to replay it. Okay, well, I'm not gonna replay it, but there is this thing. So we're gonna see. It's a crumbling cavern. There's a freaking cat that popped out. And I think apparently I can get something from him. I can see all the artifacts you have missed in the past across the different dimensional planes. Let us speak further if you wish to embark on this wisdom. Okay, so I guess there are probably things I can explore. Seek a hat from a preserved potato. Preserved potato? Ninety six percent. Do you think it's an extended map thing? Oh in the ice box thingy. Very clever, Sandra. Oh wait, let me do something. Let me just turn on my... This one? 
Yes, there we go. And I did not bother to walk back because it's way too far. <laughs> There's a lot of walking in this game. You guys are on screen! <laughs> How do you know it's going inside a YouTube video? <laughs> Hopefully Tots will come visit his old man soon. I would like to have this. I would like you to have this. A farmer hat. There we go. Hi, <laughs> mom. Is there anything else? Let's see. Oh, I, I, I did post the entire walk. <laughs> and see, I've already forgotten that I posted the entire walk through. <laughs> Okay, let's see. What else could I be could I be missing? Oh, there we go. I got a little water. Wow, a little heart. Go back to the kitty. Kitty? What kitty? Oh, I actually really love this one. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this. this is <laughs> I, like it's it's just nice, isn't it? Looks like sunglasses. <laughs> okay, I think that is it for that section. So, eh, I see. So let's go to the station. So this is the extended map. Sunset Station. Let's just talk to them. Hello, Annie. Isn't it weird that it's a different time of day here? Wait, isn't this also supposed to be where the green graveyard is? It is? My only lead are some papers I found lying around earlier. They said, I don't know why it's there. Maybe dimensions and portals or something. LOL. I wonder what that means. Yeah, that, that doesn't help. What the heck? Um, hello, Annie? <laughs> Monty shop. Is this Monty? Are you Monty? Hello. Have you taken a ride on the Limitless line yet? No. Go do that and come back to me. Okay, you've got a cool tattoo. What's this? A daily cha- There's daily challenges? Whoa. Okay, let's look around first. Is there anything I can interact with? Nothing. Okay, seems fine. Let's talk to this guy. Wait, no. Oh, it's just a sign. <laughs> All aboard! Departing Sunset Station. Tickets, please! Oi, Turnip Boy, I see you got your complimentary Sunset Station ticket in the mail. It's named this because of the odd way this area always looks like the sun is setting. No watering in the station now, it's time to walk. Get your stubs moving. Let's get the show on the road. Let's go. Whoa. What? Is that it? What the heck? Stabby stab! Wait, so the, the station is just a, an area where I just stab animals? I don't know. Ooh, there's ships. Oh my god! Oh my god! Ah! Hey, she can love it. Ah. Oh. Sheesh. Okay, okay. Ah, I need a heart. Okay, oh, there's no heart. There's no heart. What the heck? Oh, what the heck? A king pig? I'm smarter now! Let's go! I'm smarter now! <laughs> Wait, I got a ticket on the left. Bacon! Bacon! Burping on stream, that's the best. 
Good show. Huh? I'm sure you've noticed, but there's no ordinary train, bucko. It's time for you to tap deep into your mafioso blood. The mafioso must be resourceful. They must be cunning. They must be charming. Huh? All things you don't possess. <laughs> so we're here to work on it. Here are some train exec exclusive trinkets. Choose wisely. They could make or break your time here on the limitless line. What the heck? Who's this? Old Lady Lemon. Wait, is that? <gasps> Come closer, dearie. My eyes aren't what they used to be. Mm -hmm. I haven't seen that warning can in ages. It was a gift to my ex-husband. Yep. Old Man Lemon was the love of my life, but I was done being an accomplice to his ruthless killing. Ooh, shit. It seems you've fallen down the same path, Sunny. Oh, no. <laughs> Back in the day, I was a catch, a steal, the talk of the town. I'm a free spirit, Sunny. I needed to break free and explore the world. I love that. I faked my own death. Um, <laughs> I've been here ever since. <laughs> oh, it just goes through the same thing. Okay, I have water. <laughs> okay, I have coffee that makes me go zoom. Plastic fangs, a chance to heal on enemy death. Or fairy wings, increases your trip's range. Oh, I can... Oh, I never actually tripped. So we're not using the butterfly wings. <laughs> you want to fake your death too, Sandra? <laughs> what the heck? Wait, it is between plastic fangs, which is a chance to heal on an enemy's death, or a coffee that makes me go zoom. I feel like I want to go coffee though, but I don't know how fast the coffee is. But a chance to heal an enemy death, that assumes that I can kill my enemy. <laughs> so you know what? We're gonna do coffee. <laughs> Hydrate up, guys. Oh my god, I am moving faster. Let's go. Oh shit. You know what? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! What the heck is this? That's it! I literally just... <clears throat> Okay, not terrible, not terrible. But there's no hearts, I might actually die. Oh my god, it's these guys again. Uh. Oh my god. Is that a heart anywhere? Can I get a- I- is, is, is Yeah, I think the scoreboard is the number of carriages I cleared. If this is just the extended game, it's kinda sad. Shite. Shite. Oh my god! Eh, my range is just terrible. Oh my god. You don't pfft, I don't <laughs> Where is my pizza? Oh, I can use <laughs> Oh shit, what's this? Daily challenge ticket allows you to participate in a daily challenge run. Oh. Can I hold 10 gallons? Wait, wait. Oh, I have one, one blue ticket. Allows you to participate in a daily challenge. So, wait, so this is the... No fucking way. 83... 119 kill? Wait, does that mean I, I, I still have it? Do I still have it? Oh, I can still run this? Oh, so that is it. Just limit... Ayoi. 
There's a limit limitless line. That's it. Oh. Okay, I I have no idea what that um. Give me a moment. Let me take a look. What is this? What is this? <laughs> okay. Sure. Sure. Okay. Oh, you. Oh, you. No hearts. It's so cute. It is cute. It is cute. We believe it. Oh my gosh. Bacon, bacon. It's okay if it, if it's like rank ass stickers. I'll, <laughs> I will let you know. <laughs> I know. Wait, there's someone else. Karen. Hi, Karen. I'm a teacher at a nearby school. I co founded the fruit. Fruit and fruit and <laughs> fruit elementary school with my wife, Mrs. W. Mrs. W. I was looking for a new place to take the youngins on a field trip, and stumble upon this train station. Oh, I I don't think that's 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 um. I wasn't gonna enter, but the train beckons me. Oh no, oh no. Well, anyways, enjoy your ride. <laughs> Oh, we have got new items. Well, one new item. A chance for enemies to catch on fire when hit. A chance for enemies to catch on fire when hit. You have increased your trip range. Chance to heal. Well, I think either one, it's fine. So maybe I'll do lighter. Let's give that a shot. Let's see what this does. Is it something I have to equip? No. Okay. Ooh, <gasps> it's caught on fire. Am I dying? Actually, yeah, I, I should eat my pizza. <gasps> no outside food on the train. I don't want to clean up that greasy garbage, so knock it off. Dang it. <gasps> no, it's not even possible. Dang. Oh, you. Slice up this onion. <laughs> burn, burn, burn. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Oh, let's go. I'm gonna hide. Burn, burn. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, the fire is a little bit OP, huh? Oh. <laughs> burn. Let's go. <laughs> Good show. They say cats just have nine lives, but that's not necessarily true on the limitless line. There. Ooh, blueberry. Hi, I'm a blueberry. You're a turnip. Okay. <laughs> We're on a train. Goodbye. <laughs> okay. Okay, chance to heal on enemy's death. Chance for enemies to explode on death. Never seen this before, but okay. A chance to not take damage. <gasps> oh shit. Well, I mean, I guess the plastic fangs and the riot shield are kind of like opposites of each other, but explosive keg sounds really fun. But do you think it's like a build up on, on everything? If I take the riot shield now, will I still get the explosive keg? Hmm. Chance for enemies to explode on death. You know what? Riot shield. Just in case. 
just in case I, I kill myself, you know, with the with the bomb. <laughs> Hi, yeah. Yo, there's a there's a there's a blob. There's a blob. I want to increase the range on this. Oh my. Okay, interesting, interesting. Yeah, if if it explodes, will it hurt me? Cause if it does, then that's not. Oi. Oh. I'm getting better at this. I'm getting better at this. Burn, burn. Hey, wait. Hey. I, I probably should stop. <laughs> Dude, the rabbit can die from the, the slime blob? Yo, we might be fighting. We might be fighting with a toxic giant stag. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, burn, 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 burn. Ayoy. Ooh, ooh. Let's go, let's go. What an explosion. Sheesh. Good show. Ooh, the explosive thing is here. Just like a deer in the headlights. But the headlights are just your lifeless beady eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, on to the next car you go. Okay, let's talk this one. Nurse Berry. Turn it boy. You look hurt. Here, a berry flavored kiss should heal you right up. Aw, there we go. Coffee makes me go zoom, increase trips range, chance for enemies to explode on death. Let's just try this. I feel like this is chaotic as fuck and I would absolutely love this. Let's go. Well, oh, well, bucko. You have overcome the challenges of the train and now you're face to face with its conductor. I am the final boss. Oh, or perhaps I am just the beginning. Let's put on a good show. Show me what you're made of, turnip boy. <laughs> what? Oh, you. Oh, you. Oh, oh, what the heck? What the heck? Dang. Ooh. Burn. What the heck? It barely even burns him? <laughs> Jesus. Come on. Oh my goodness. What the heck? Wait, can I go back to Monty's shop? Oh, Monty's gonna talk to me, right? I can buy hats and unlock trinkets with blue tickets in there and great What? <laughs> he was one? What well, the thing? <laughs> I don't think he was. Okay, let's try again. Let's try again. Now we know. Now we know. Serious. We're gonna be serious. Are you worried? Or not? <laughs> oh my god. King pig. King pig. Okay, okay. 
bacon. Let's go, let's go. Orange? Please help me. I've been stuck here on this train for four days. Oh no. <laughs> the train never stops. Are we still just going in circles and circles? I just want to I just want to get off. Oh no. <laughs> Orange. <laughs> oh no. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna get explosive now. I'm gonna get plastic fangs and lighter. But I think maybe I wanna get no, I'm gonna get plastic fangs first. And then we'll just try with the healing. Oh, there you go. Not terrible, not terrible. Ooh. Oh, okay, okay. Oy. Oh, no healing, no healing, okay. Rotten cat apple, let's go, let's go. Oh my god! What the heck? Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! <laughs> Ooh! Pickle gang! I'm using all my willpower not to give you the cement shoes and throw in the pond down by the car patch with the that would be too good of a death for a tenant, you know? <laughs> what? But since you did break us out of jail, let's just say me not throwing you to the fish makes us even Steven. Now scram, we're on the run. We gotta keep a low profile. Fair. I actually still want the fire, because I think the fire was quite helpful. Because look at my freaking health. What the heck? <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah, burn, burn. <laughs> oh my god. Where are his sidekicks supposed to be? Um. <laughs> I don't know, man. Oh, yo, oh my gosh, almost. Oh, they don't die in their own slime, I guess. Come on, come on. <laughs> the worm just died. <laughs> come here, rabbit. Come here. Oh, that's it. Okay. Eat. Stag. Okay, okay. Stab, 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 stab. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> and more cruelty. I'm sorry, Hill. <laughs> Not terrible. Let's go. Oh. It's Timothy and Gordon. Okay. So we have explosive keg, fairy wings, or riot shield. I think it'll have to be riot shield for me. Just because it's a chance to not take damage. Might be helpful. Okay, let's go. This is the final one. Uh, wish me luck. Oh my goodness. We can do this. We can do this. I am the final boss. Yes, yes, yes. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Yep. Yep. Let's go. Let's go. Are you? Oh, oh. Come on, come on, fire. Oh my god, no! No, 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 no! Oh, 
Good show, Lieutenant Boy. You still aren't cunning on charming? My show got mafioso blood in ya. Yeah, thank you. With one and a half hearts. <laughs> Good show, Bucko. Let's go. Now it's time to pick your last trinket. Oh, what? You thought you were done? Mm. Going through this train once is not enough to prepare you for what comes after this. Whether it's fighting the likes of my brother or dodging the RRS. Okay. <laughs> I'll be doing this forever. Uh. Always bashing buddies, always moving, always facing me. Car to car it goes. So this is the limitless line. It only gets harder from here. Yeah, I don't think this is sustainable at all. <laughs> Maya's brother, yep. Hi there, Karen. Oh, it's the exact same thing. Oh, okay. Let's see, we have explosive keg, coffee makes me go zoom, or fairy wings. I kinda want explosive keg, but I've got a feeling I'll probably die in the next one. So good luck. <laughs> oh. Any. It appears we're on the train and it's infinite. That can't be right. Anyway, have you found any el el elites yet? Elites are beefed up enemies that have more health, do more damage, and have special abilities. Oh, fuck, bro. <laughs> There's the aggro elites who attack faster. There's the steel plated elites who have way more health. And then there's the poison elites who will poison you if you get hit. Lastly, there's giant elites which are, well, well giant. <laughs> I hope this information helps you on a trip. What the heck? No? No, it doesn't. Dude, I have like one and a half hearts. Can you at least heal me, Annie? I think, yeah, maybe the stag, the cat, the. Last one, what's the um all those are like giant elites probably? Oh my god. <laughs> yep, yep, I die from the explosive. Fuck <laughs> Oh my god 41 I'm I'm barely even on that freaking list man Yo, I'm like halfway. There is no fucking way. What's this? Daily challenge ticket allows you to participate in a daily challenge run. You can only- There's no way I'm running the daily challenge run. Let's pick- Oh, I can't even get a hat. <laughs> Dang it, so that's it. I honestly thought there'll be more to this, but it's just a limitless train and I cannot be fucked. <laughs> I actually cannot care about- getting high scores but I honestly think that's it it's literally the same things just harder and harder monsters dang it it's kind of sad I was hoping it would be more too but oh it is a 100% game though on the left dang that's it it's kind of sad Well, yeah. I think, you know what? It's still early. I am going to go play Apex. <laughs> I'm gonna go play Apex. And, um, yep. <laughs> Let me open up Apex. And then we're gonna get into some games. It has been a while since I drank Sherry Tea's Oolong Milk Tea. And it is surprisingly sweet. Sandra should play Outlast. I know, right? No. Apex Legonas. <laughs> yes, that. I'm gonna get into that. Let me change my category. It's gonna work. Can it work? Apex Legends. <laughs> Why am I on Hillside? Because it's content. Because <laughs> it's content. So I'm like, why not, right? But yeah, no. Um, of course, if you don't feel comfortable, <laughs> etc. <cetera. laughs> Absolutely not something you have to do. Um, let me change this. Apex Legend. And then let me change this one. Yes. So that it is like halfway.
okay. Everything should be fine. What's the lifeline? Play as lifeline? Ugh. Yeah, she can't stream. <laughs> she she's unable to make content off the, off of that. Oh, it's Olympus. I'm gonna go play lifeline on Olympus. Let's go. We're gonna we're gonna get some um internet points, cause why not? But yeah, thank you guys for joining Discord. I I really appreciate it. I uh, hope you guys like what's been set up. You know, feel free to interact, uh, introduce yourself, and all that good stuff. And select your roles. Oh, you guys have selected some of your roles. Thank you for selecting. Ho, 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 ho. Either you're with me or you're against me. Or you're with me and against me. Because that happens sometimes. There's, there's a win out there. It's waiting for us. We're gonna do Lafla. Let's go, Lafla. This is gonna be a good fight. No, I'm not the jump master. Jump master here. Good thing my buddies and I aren't afraid of heights. Go, ready? Let's check out that way. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Potentially two teams? Yep. Dang. Three teams, actually. I don't know where they're gonna land. <laughs> I did not mean to land in the same building, oh my god. Shit, 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 shit. How is enough is a fucking prowler? I mean, I hear the guy, <laughs> but I don't want to go there. I don't want to go there. Is there another gun? Is there another gun? An alternate with 19 bullets? You know what? <laughs> Might as well. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Okay, this is good. This is good. Where's the guy? Where's the guy? I should be back. I should be back. Am I back? Am I back? Am I back? No, barely. Oh, I, I'm down. Am I back? I should be back. <laughs> Why did I just crash? And I died. Am I back? Am I back? Yo, oh, I'm back. All oh, right, that was kind of shit. <laughs> that was kind of shit. Okay. Death box here. The wing skin is nice. Ooh, I see, I see. Um, yeah, actually, that's fine. Going. 
Uh, I have a lot of... <laughs> I have a lot of bombs. <laughs> Reminds you of Transformers. Ooh, that's true. Are they fighting? Oh, they are fighting, huh? Okay. Oh wait, there's a lot of uh, little things that I'm gonna go uh, loot. <laughs> Looks like some people have been there. Uh, what is this? What is this? Yup, the fighting, the fighting. It's slightly choppy on your end. Is it choppy for other people also? Oh, they're moving so fast. Okay. It's all right now? Okay, good, good, good. Oh, they're fighting so much. Let's go. They're going to like four for fifth, some of them. <laughs> so... Sounds like there's a lot of teams. One of our ooh, one of our team teammates had kill leaders. It's very nice, very very nice. Okay, uh, can I swap this one out? I guess the this one out. <laughs> Let me see if I can find R three one. It's not in yeah. There we go. I dropped it. I dropped it. There are two stack probably. Portal to there. Port out? No, it doesn't seem like that in two seconds. I smell victory. It smells like shots fired and they're hitting Portal's ready. Let's go, let's fight. Wait, where's the other guy? Oh, we can someone rush? You can do that, bro. Rush, 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 rush. That line. Oh, why? Oh my god. No almost. Alright, alright. He is such a uh, backseat gamer. <laughs> you late bro bro, I, I I don't actually care, but you know what? <laughs> Yeah, Reef did not give a shit. Actually, I think that was just very annoying. I'm gonna lower down general chat. <laughs> I mean, it's pubs, so that's fine. Let's turn it off. I love to hear people. 
I love I love hearing them yell shit at me and um, you know, <clears throat> think that you they're like ace you. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I when they just open my account here, I think. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> I'll do that. I'll do it next time on. It's like, bro, shut the fuck up. I'm sorry you lost, but look on the bright side. I won. No, <laughs> no, all your screaming is there, is there. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Let's jump here, okay. Well, provider is actually in game. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> but your reformed new year, new you. Uh huh. Right, feline. Uh huh. For certain death. Oh, we're going to the ship? Where are we going? You guys can have fun looting that. I'm gonna go in further. Hmm. <gasps> okay, I'll keep the digital thread for. What the fuck? We're not all in the ring. Check your position. Did I get shot? Felt like I got shot. <laughs> Will I die? No. Okay. <laughs> I just need to make sure. No swearing from today, mark your words. Uh huh. My God, that was not it. That was not. That was not it. I could not. <laughs> that was dumb. Why did I do that? We can keep a swear jar for him. One, <laughs> one swear, one cent. That's actually really cheap. How are we gonna make money off of that? <laughs> Okay. But actually, one sin, one swear, so that's 10 sin. Wow, so you need to swear a hundred times for us to get a dollar. Dang. Right? Yes. Math. <laughs> mm. Look, I just swear. <laughs> I got free BBT every week. That is true. That is true. Let's open up. Let's see what you get. Oh, lame. 
So basically things that I, any, uh, I don't, I don't play any of them. God dang it. Okay, I'm gonna play a different character. <laughs> I can't do this. Oh, Olympus for five minutes, let's go. <laughs> Whatever you say. <laughs> exactly. I bet tomorrow we'll get like mm, 10 cents. 10 swords. It's not too bad. Revenant, let's go. I go and I hate being cooped up. <laughs> and Bangalore. Spent gunpowder. Smells like victory. Smells like victory. This is your champion. No nice, only mean. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, she's doing a SpongeBob thing. <laughs> new year, new me. I would love to see like one stream where my mods both on stream don't fight with each other. <laughs> the chances of that happening is as Hi, as when Sandra and I are modding feline streams. Oi. Hey, wow, wow, this one, bro, are you for real? Were you not in like the previous one? Another ref mean, yo. Bring the fire rear, yeah, yeah, exactly. The fuck? Oh, they're running. Let's go, let's run, let's run. Is there a benefit of what? Ooh, ooh, ooh. You know what? Let's do that. Ice. Bruh. Nothing. Shit. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god. Oh, they got a double tap. Oof. Okay, that was actually terrible. I have no bullets. <laughs> Fuck, I have no bullets. Uh, dang it. Okay, I'm just gonna eh, heal. Yeah, I, I barely hurt anything. <laughs> I was just like, huh. I think I need to swap out a gun. There's no way I'm holding onto this gun. You know what? Let's just do this for the time being. Oh, wait. There is a, like one stack. And, like, that's it. Dang it. Should I? You know what? Uh, damn it. I have one stack either way. I can't 
die, right? <laughs> okay. I just need to make sure, you know. Evo shield here. Level two. Bang glove looks a little bit ug ugly. Excuse me. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> How dare you? Okay, so now that I have all of the freaking bullets. I don't have enough. I don't have a freaking heavy gun now. What the heck? Look, Where do I don't want to fight? Dang it, I don't want to go all the way back. Ah, uh, no, I don't want 30 30. <laughs> Where are they going? Why is that guy so far away? Oh, he's saying that there's danger too. Okay. I see, I see. No freaking guns here. No freaking way. Not a single one. Oh my god. Yo, my my dudes. Uh, where is his alt? Oh my god. Oh, it's gone. Dang it. It's upstairs. They're upstairs. Okay. Yo. This is not it, man. We're just getting stuck. Oh, and then they're all gone. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, I'm spotted. Oh my god! Oh no! <laughs> Dang it! Yeah, that, that was uh, terrible. <laughs> what the heck is this? Okay, okay. <laughs> Wait, there's one day left to ranked Broken Moon. Dang. I'm gonna play ranked. Let's play ranked. GG. Hmm, how are all of your weekends? I hope your weekends were good. I guess some of you guys are still going through your weekends, but... How is it so far? <laughs> I actually really like Broken Moon, mainly because of the zip lines. That's it. It's kind of fun. <laughs> Omakase. Hmm. Clips are what civvies use in their hair. This is called a magazine. Ooh. Let's see. I think your weekend had good food. <gasps> Please explain. Don't, don't tell me it's like like fancy Italian food. <laughs> that fancy Italian food. Also, that is a really cool skin. Mr. Bing 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 I don't even know what I ate. Oh, I, I made food. <laughs> Has mod number two eaten his dinner? Heard that. It's a famous one time meal. Ooh. Yeah, I totally forgot. I don't I think I only went what out to buy fun? groceries. Yeah. You had lock lock five sticks. Good job. Sky mod number two still team. Uh, I I don't know what to say. If he is, wow, first blood. where are we going? I'm assuming down. So I'm gonna go this house. 
Oh my god, you're actually working. What a workaholic. Chat, can we please bully him to get off of work? Because it's like 9.35pm right now in Singapore. Please. Bully him to get off of work. What's this? Have all L star? Yeah, I want L star. They're already fighting. Wait, wait, let me get some more energy. No time for rest. It's good. <laughs> Bully you so you can go. <laughs> what the? No. Hell. Are you okay? What's inside here? Um. Oh, they're actually fighting. The ring is distant. Wait, the omakase guy is just right inside. Taking fire. Jesus. Under fire. Down the target. Throwing thermite. Can I get some more bullets? Nope. Reloading. I guess not. So many people fighting. Okay. Oh, I need syringes. Never mind. <laughs> I don't need syringes. <laughs> okay. So many. It's a smooth walk day for you too, Hill. Star. Okay, you know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. Level three. Sandwich them. Yo, see, see. Um, no. Cells, eh? Might as well. If I have the space, I, I I can take it. I can take it. Charge? Who's gonna play a charge? <laughs> I want to swap out my light. Maybe. Otherwise, you know, just get like. <gasps> oh. I can use that. I can use that. I was I was not paying attention. <laughs> Thanks. Still loves you, baby. Office here. Close range. Gotta hop a standard stock here. I don't do that. I don't really want. Mm. Yeah. I need another set of light. Backpack here. I need light ammo. Here. Yo, he is pinging like crazy and I freaking love it. Let's go, let's go. I can use that. You know, I already have it. <laughs> Never mind. 
Never mind. Thank you. Light ammo here. Wow, look at him. Come get some. Alert five, Valkyrie actual. Ready for burn. How copy? Main engine burn. Okay, not too bad. Please direct your attention to the flight attendants as they demonstrate free falling and deserting death. Level two. Actually, everyone has it. Um, I'm gonna swap this. All right. Seems seems really good. Seems really good. I love how this vault doesn't play around the caustic at all. <laughs> So it's like Caustic drops all of his traps, but <laughs> we just leave. <laughs> we just leave. Do I prefer Toem or Turnip? Man, Turnip is really short though. Turnip's like two hours of gameplay. But I love the I love I love the the art style of turn it a little bit more on poem simply because of the colors and how cute it is Another bogey. but i think in terms of like uniqueness in the game style poem yeah i know i see i see Should, uh, are we fighting are we not fighting yeah, the design, the art style of Turnip is really, really good. Um, just gameplay-wise, it's fine. Um, I don't like how repetitive some of it felt. Like, I had to go back and forth, back and forth in some of the characters to, like, treat um, things. We should probe that sector over there. But yeah. But I, I hate how unsatisfying Toem is when it comes to the completionist. Because it's like... Y like you have like you can't actually go through the entire thing um to complete it like like i mean you can't go through an entire thing before the credits roll in order to complete it so that's kind of annoying i feel sense of accomplishment of tome because it's a long build and the ending of the prison thing very fair, very fair. Yes, I agree. I, I I feel like the oh my god, I feel like the way that that they built it up is actually not bad. Oh, he has already. Uh, yeah, it's just unsatisfying if you're a completionist because you cannot complete the entire thing. Like that's oh. Crack's placement doesn't matter for you. Okay, that's fair. Ring aim far. Top of one. Real leader. I must confess, it's what I long for. Who? I need a bunch of like light actually. What the heck? There's like no fucking light. Okay. You know what? Extended energy bag here. Level three. Let's just carry off energy. Thanks. Rings moving. Hustle up. Oh. Rampage here. Optics here. Ooh, a four by ten digital sniper. Dang. 
Oh, there we go. Good amount of light. Okay. Care package incoming. Y'all earned this. Just watch your backs. That jump pad out there can come in handy. Oh. Uh, this is your last call for lift off. Okay. Go. I forgot again that she has all. <laughs> I always yearned for kill me. Oh, shite. Oh, we can't do that. Okay, never mind. Give me a sec. Recharge. Oh shit. Where? Shields are recharging. Yeah, I need to use this Phoenix kit. Healing my wounds. Heads up, dropping the pain. Pop in the chimney. We should go here. You know he's gonna fight. <laughs> replicator being delivered. Eyes up, incoming replicator. Recharging shields. Oh, where? Oh. Well, that's far. I don't have the sights for it. Ooh, okay, never mind. Um bullets, 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 bullets. There's something I can you know, let's pick this up. I might need cells actually, but what is more important? Bullets I can spray or cells? <laughs> Fuck. This vault skin pretty good, A tier, I like it too. One minute until a nearby ring closes. Uh, yes, you know what? Cells, cells, cells. Let's, let's find some more cells, just in case. Actually, no, no, we're not gonna do it. <laughs> I am just so confused. <laughs> we're not gonna do cells. We have enough batteries. Yo, I'll... Ball, where are you going? Ooh. I need it. Wow, thank you. Oh, <laughs> what was that climb? Okay. Okay, we we're just barely. Dang it. Touching down. They usually carry rare platforms. I'm pick up just a little bit. Not terrible, not terrible. This is fine. Let's see, let's see. Is there anyone coming in? Is there anyone? No? Okay. I'm sorry, I just want to get my ass <laughs> handed to me from behind. Okay. Seems fine. Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> We're at top two. Oh, I suggest we analyze those grounds. Getting enemy spotted. Close. Enemy 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 close. Enem
What the heck? Target spotted. Target, I have a subject in view. Spotted a subject. Oh my god! Let's go! Let's go! <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Holy shit! Oh my god! W star! W star! <laughs> Holy crap! That was so satisfying! 965 damage! Oh, let's go! Let's go! <laughs> oh, this is exciting. I almost lost it. I actually almost lost it. <laughs> but I ranked up. Let's go! Let's go! Apex Predator with Bangalore. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That was so clash. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm like shaking because this is just so freaking rare. <laughs> like that guy cracked shields. But I'm so glad that I had, I had just a bit more health and a bit better aim. <laughs> The season ends in 29 days, but the map is going to change in tomorrow. Interesting. Does anyone know what the next map is? <laughs> I'm asking because like, you know. Red lobbies, here we come. Uh-huh. <laughs> yes. It's going to be a Bangalore Pret lobby. <laughs> Where's number two mod? Does he know? This is going to be fun. Number two mod. What's the next map? Introducing your champion. Better find me before I find you. Last place mod is working. Well, it's almost 10 p.m. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna disturb him any anyway. I know I'm on, on like second monitor level. <laughs> there we go, number two more. Okay. <laughs> Olympus? Really? <gasps> Storm points not in the rotation. Yo, I'm excited. I'm on Olympus. It's been a while. I mean, like, I, I, I've, I've, no, I've actually never seen Olympus in ranked. I've not played Olympus in ranked before. Which I think, honestly, it's like, ooh, L star, let's go. Eh, I actually don't need heavy. Very nice, very nice. Wingman. Wingman here. Backpack here. Level two. What's this? Times two. Nope. I keep taking heavy like as if I <laughs> have heavy. <laughs> Dang it. Okay. Ooh. I need it. I look forward to Olympus. I think I'll actually play. Oh, they looted this one. Okay. I think I'll actually play it a bit more um, if it's Olympus next round. I'm on my laptop, so audio only from that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Thank you. What 
more other stuff are here. Um, I'm just gonna use this. I don't know, man. Um, there's some energy over there. I'm gonna go take it. Let's go. Let's go. Who wants to see it rain? Is anyone going further up? Or like to the other circle? Actually, oh, they've not opened these yet. Out of your team's all yours is the best. <laughs> Well, if you put it this way. Oh, I don't have a good shield. Oh. Eh, I need energy. Forgot about energy. Actually, maybe I get rid of this and I use this instead. Let's do this one. What's this? Is this a drop? <gasps> right in front of us. Ooh, there we go. Oh, no, actually. Yes, let's go. Backpack here, level three. Got an Evo shield here, level two. Care pack. <laughs> I always forget the term for it. Care pack. Don't mention it. Ooh. Okay, okay. What are we gonna do? Let's go over there. <laughs> Let's go over there, but we don't Stop actually. Here, Scorpius so for again. Wingman. <gasps> Freaking wingman? No, there was wingman just now. Dang it. It's okay, it's okay. R301 and L star. Which is gonna be my W star, hopefully. <laughs> oh. Where are we going? Oh, we just we just took one big loop. <laughs> we just took one big loop, and, and we're back. We're back. What the heck? That, that's kind of late. I need a bit more batteries. Yep. I quite like the chill in the games. See, I agree. Tome and Turnip are pretty good games. I think for anyone else who has like game suggestions that's not horror games, feel free to add it to Discord. That'll be fun. I can't remember if you played any more of these games. What do you mean any of these games? Um, I actually really enjoy chill games i mean simulation games are one of the games that I, <laughs> I would always play like you know you build your own theme park you build your own hotel you build your own this and that outlast yeah nope <laughs> um not on stream i used to play stardew valley stardew valley is in a chill game that i completed ish it's really fun. It's very chill, it's really very chill. But it's sometimes a little bit slow. A little bit too slow. It really depends on your on what you like. Stray, but Stray is not on, on sale, unfortunately. You can only remember Tone and Tone. Yep, I, I don't believe I play any other indie games. But thank you for the follow, Jason. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> We're just playing a bit of Apex because 
well, we thought that um, Turnip Boy commits tax evasion has like extended math. But there isn't. Um, <laughs> I mean, like, there is a, a tiny extended map, but it's nothing special, I guess. It's just an infinity boss battle. That's it. But yeah, welcome. Are we gonna fight? I don't see anyone. Oh, we're going back. <laughs> what the heck? What are we doing? Take it, take it. Pacifist run, yeah. It. Dibs. <laughs> Neither of them are taking it. What the heck? I think, if I'm not wrong, I should have... One or two more games that are kind of like indie, kind of chill. Um, well, okay, maybe not chill. <laughs> I have one called Bones Cafe that I've not uh, started yet. Uh, Bones Cafe is basically you running a restaurant and you can uh, commit... Um, what's, what's that term when you uh, eat? eat people of the same kind uh, <laughs> outlaws no. <laughs> cannibalism yes cannibal <laughs> i love how the guy that's working knows more <laughs> is more aware than oh oh i i apologize if that's what you want <laughs> cannibalism yes and, oh, there's a certain level of cannibalism in Bones Cafe where you uh, basically poison, apparently, <laughs> poison your customers and then you feed them to other customers. That's, that's, um, <laughs> that's kind of the idea. So, <laughs> I think it'll be quite fun to see. So, there's a little bit of like a simulation management situation going on. Um, yeah. I, I can't remember if there's another game. I will update you guys if I if I recall. But yeah. How do you even sustain that biz? Um <laughs> I don't know. We can We can gate gatekeep them actually. <coughs> I might throw my ult actually if they come down here but they could go down the other side actually so we'll see we'll see it's still not coming down yeah it could be on the left side they're not coming down I'm gonna go down here. Ooh. There we go. I don't know. I can't see them. Ooh, I heard someone. Uh oh. Oh, he is far, far. Okay. Wait, why, why can't I climb this? Ew, well, I really can't climb this shit. Oh my goodness.
Good luck. Yo, this is like sleep slippery as shit, man. I can't find the shit. Yo, red. Okay, nope. <laughs> I'm taking notes. Yes, Hill. I <laughs> I did not realize that they were falling back. It's a W key pusher. That's me. <laughs> GG. GG. So, Hale, what notes have you taken? Please, share it with the class. <laughs> Please share it with the class. The class needs to know. <laughs> Minus 5 RP. Good enough. Good enough. Miss every <laughs> Yes. Yes. That sounds correct. That sounds about right. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Sandra, you're you're hundred percent class monitor. There is no way you're not a class monitor. Should I play Bloodhound? Let's try Bloodhound. I'm gonna do Seer and Bloodhound. Because why not, right? Ooh, Bang and Blood and Seer. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Class Monta and she's laughing. Yeah. Because <laughs> she's not like uptight, you know? She's not uptight. Double skin, yes. So. Bang will throw her smokes and then we will scan like crazy. We will scan like crazy. Anyway, hydrate guys, hydrate. Let's go, let's go. Two teams, one... Oh, above us, okay. <coughs> They're going to the left. Okay. Yo, this is huge. I was not expecting it to be this big. <laughs> That's what she said. Huh. I don't want this. Disgusting. Okay, what, what guns are here? Eva, Mozambique. You know what? Let's sort this. Actually, no. Let me just carry some more heavy and then we'll probably swap it. You stole my life. <laughs> you know what? I'm not gonna be mean. <laughs> oh, that's it. Huh. Hmm. Let's swap. He's crafting? What the heck? There's like uh, two teams on the other side. Well, I mean, I guess they are on the other side, so... <laughs> kind of safe? Hop up here. Yo... I'm just gonna carry that. Because I am greedy as fuck, man. <laughs> I'm gonna carry that and I'm just gonna wait. Since they're all crafting. What's this? Turbo 50 seven, 75. Let's just do this. Why six seven? Let me do this. Evil points. Thank you. 
Ooh, another anvil. Whoa, this guy. Pog, Pog. I want an R301. If you see an R... Why would there be an anvil with no R301? This is like trolling. This is absolutely trolling. Oh, I've got way too many bullets. <laughs> I don't have enough for my shotgun. Are I, are I? Yes. No? Shit. Eh, you know what? We'll see. We'll see. I might swap that out. We'll see. R301. R301. Let's pray. Let's pray. We will get an R301 in the next box that I open. Yes. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> and this is why I don't believe in God. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Copium? Why am I coping? Spitty. Spitty's fine, but I have a attachment that I want to use. Yeah, Eli, you need to stop walking. Oh, they're actually going. Okay, let's go. Let's go. You need to take a break and work tomorrow. <laughs> I mean, yeah, honestly, you just, you're, you're, you're going to continue working tomorrow anyway, you know? So what's the difference? You need a backpack? Oh, I could pick up cells, actually. Um, are they fighting? Oh, they're, they might be. Dang it. Back back here. Level one. Oh well, oh well. If I can't find R301, that's fine. I'm super split up. I'm just gonna follow one person. I'm gonna follow Bang. Let's go, Bang. Yeah, where is R3? Uh, sounds like could be fighting. Is it? Helmet here, level two. Mind those headshots. Thank you. R three o. Let's go! I believe in God now. <laughs> and a cog. Okay, actually, I, I don't know how good it is with an R3, but... <laughs> Where are we going? Where are we going? We're actually in the zone. I'm gonna pick it up? No. No, I'm gonna pick it up. <laughs> I'll probably need it. <laughs> Where have we left? I have materials for us. Might be something good this way. Nope. Nope. Enemy spotted. <laughs> I can't. I can't ping. Recently. 
Bruh, he's still crafting. Okay, okay. You know what? That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I don't think we're that ready to fight anyway, but it's okay. 35 seconds ago. Cool. We're near the next zone. That's great. Now. Ooh. My God. Where the heck were they aiming from at this rate? Oh, that's not team. Oh my gosh. Let's go, bang. Let's go. Oh, last next stream. <laughs> what the heck? Scan, right? Yes, yes, I can. Whoa, where? Whoa, where? Are we going? Are we going? Are we not going? Can I scan? Should I scan? Oh, that's an extreme. <laughs> Absolutely not. That's nuts. Seven squats, seven squats. Come on, come on, come on. Yeah, package incoming. Someone traveled through here recently. Let's go that way. Way down there, then. What? <gasps> My face is itchy. I feel like they might want to go for the care package, just cause it's just right there. Care package over there. We might die. <laughs> Top seven squats and minus five. Yeah. Yeah, it's a super passive run, that's why. Anything good? Okay, I guess not. It's super passive. This is absolutely super passive. There's a shield downstairs. That's good. Um, 
Oh, he's camping. Nah. Hmm. Where are we going? Where are we? Oh. Oh, I guess not. <laughs> oh, they're fighting. There's two teams. And yeah, it's fine. I'm gonna wait for a little bit. I hope they don't... Um, cringe rifle. Okay, cringe rifle wants to fight. Uh, we might be. Ready, guys. I want to ulti. I want to ulti. I want to ulti. You guys, come near, please. All right. He wants to ulti. He wants to ulti. Let's go. Oh, yikes. Shush. Five. <laughs> I can third them. Yeah, I have no good angle for this. Dude, that's a lifeline heal. Very nice, very nice. Let's go, let's go. Oh my god, this guy. Actually, let me just see if I have. Smoke me, smoke me, smoke me, smoke me, smoke me. Okay, we're gonna swap out. Um, okay, how do I not have heat shield until now? Oh my god. Okay. Hey, go, just go inside, go inside, go inside. Hold this, hold this. Relax, holy crap, the, bro. The, the, drop the armor here. Drop the armor. Oh. Armor and drop, drop here, drop here. Is there more armors? Nope. <laughs> Wait, are they not wearing any armor? I don't. Is there any other armors? Go in this. Remember, just if you low, just try to swap. If you low, just try to swap. Let's go. Yo, yo, on, 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 on. on top, on top. Stay, 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 stay here. Spot it. Guys, inside, please. Hey, relax, lah, bro. Uh, Uh oh Okay, just gonna farm. Kill the kill leader, that's good.
Okay, okay. Not bad. We are strong, we are strong. We are strong, we are strong. <laughs> I know this guy here. <laughs> okay, okay. Wedding where? Only one person. No, oh, it's just charge. Okay. I am gonna heal for them. Okay. Is there anyone on the roof? Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. They, they go already. Alright. You can wait. Last. Uh, oh, last score. 93. Already. 7% of it. Oh my god. We might actually not have to play. Outlast. Shoot them, shoot them, shoot them. Shoot them. Don't let them cross. Stuck there. I have nothing to throw at them. I have old. I have old. Old, old, old. Can you old? Oh, they're not. They're not going up. Are they not going up? Very low, very low. Am I in Oh, okay. He's super super low. Good, 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 good. Oh my Should we have pushed that? Okay, now what the heck? We have our Apex champions. Cringe needs to shut the fuck up, man. It was a good game. Well, it was a very slow game, but <laughs> it was still a good game. <laughs> yeah, I, I thought like we also should have stayed. Hmm. Who is good? I ooh a loba skin and a this is a rare skin a catalyst skin isn't this like a normal skin? I'm sorry. <laughs> yes, a loba skin finally is a character that I actually play. I love this. I love this. I still don't know what the crafting material does to be honest, <laughs> but you know what? <laughs> rare is not very rare. Yeah. Loba is thick. Okay. <clears throat> <sighs> Fuck. <laughs> Let's put it this way. Okay. If by this October, Halloween, I, I am still streaming and I'm an affiliate, 
I will do one out of Outlast for Halloween. For Halloween, I will do it. Halloween, I'll do it. Maybe I will play like. Um, I wanna play Bang. I'm gonna play Bang. I am for real. If I'm affiliate by the by October, I will play one hour of Outlast on stream. Will I enjoy it? Fuck no. <laughs> Number one more will be taking vacation leave. <laughs> no, no. We are not bargaining <laughs> the length of Outlast. I'm not gonna do it. One hour, that's it. Yeah, you guys heard it. You can clip it. Affiliate by October. I will do it. Whoa, we're jumping here? But yeah, good luck. We have a long way to go, so... <laughs> There's a team below. Are they going to the same place? Yep, we're probably going to our right. We're going to the center. Shit. Shit. Oh my god, I do not have any more ammo. Shit, another prowler? Oh my gosh. Come on, 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 come on. Oh, let's go. Oof. Oof. Okay, I, I want to swap out that freaking dumbass shit. <laughs> I cannot. What is this? She has to, uh, yeah, I have to be affiliate first and then we will discuss if. More subs means more hours, fuck. <laughs> I need 11 more followers. But I think it's like within the a, a month or a period or something. So I think it's a little bit more than 11 sub, uh, followers. Oh, I have it already. Oh, let's go. Hello. Uh, let me just ping this then. Backpack here. Level one. Optics here. Close range. Highlights your enemies. Um. Yes, fifty followers for affiliate within like a period of time. I don't know if it's like three months or a month or something like that, but yeah, that's that's roughly the range. We can go and take a look later on to see how close I am to it. I mean, I'm not going to show you guys. Because <laughs> it might be very private and a little bit personal, but... um, It's time period. I don't know how close we are, actually. Now that I'm... Actually, we should be quite safe, right? I, I, I can take a look at it right now. Let me see. Let me go hide in a corner and then I'll let you guys know. Care package incoming. Y'all earned this. Just watch your backs. Oh, batteries. Let me, let me go pick up. Oh my god, there's so many batteries. Yes, please. Phoenix kid here. Drop shocked and rocked. Like the good oh, days. no more batteries. Okay, okay, okay. Let me swap over. And then let me. <laughs> you can pull <laughs> God dang it. Um, which one is it? It is stream? No. Channel? Um, no. I'm sorry. I, can, I can't see because, like, it is small, so I can't tell. Um, almost an affiliate. Let's see. Where is the full layout thing? 
Oh, there we go. Okay, so the requirements are evaluated over the last 180 days. That's what, six months? And actually, yeah, 37 or 50. So we are 13 away. Yes, we're 13 away. So yeah, there you guys go. 13 away to 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 follower. Uh to affiliate. And then that should be it. You're so far. <laughs> Easy? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Um, I want a bit more. Actually, never mind. I want my art. Yeah, thank you. Well, hail. <laughs> there you go. Affiliate and 13 more followers within six months. Well, actually, a little bit less than six months, but yeah. And, and, and you'll get it. And you'll get it. Actually, let me carry some more heavy. And you'll get one hour. <laughs> you'll get one hour of game time. That's it. Oh, what am I doing? I want something else. Um, batteries. Maybe like. Let's let me find another like a uh, bomb or something. One hour of all last. Where are they? What are those? No, I don't want this. I don't want this. I actually don't have a lot of cells. Sandra should play too. <laughs> we we are we're not we're not subjecting her to we're not subjecting her to that. I think if she gets paid to do it, maybe she she might have a <laughs> She might have a sum that she might accept. XQC level of followers. That's no fucking way. You pay five dollars, Jesus. <laughs> Let's kill them before they die. Let's kill them before they die. <laughs> That's dumb. Okay, 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 let's go. How many followers and subs does that excuse even have? Can you tell how many subs a person has? How much do I have? I'm gonna get some bats. Gonna upgrade my shields. Tens of thousands, okay. Sounds about right. <laughs> oh, I have enough batteries actually. Uh, Ooh, let's go. Let's swap out this one. What the heck? 11.5 <laughs> Yep, you know what? Let's get there. <laughs> and then Sandra will play out last. Yo, that is crazy. 11 million. But I don't think I'm as entertaining as XQC, honestly. But anyway. <laughs> 11.5 subs, Sandra, you might want to <laughs> edit your...
Number three mod. Even if 60 doesn't have 1.5 million subs, okay. That's fair, that's fair. No more 5 million subs is crazy though, actually. That's like, what, easily billions of dollars, right? I'll be happy with 11.5 subs, honestly. But that's not enough for Syndra to play <laughs> Outlast. <laughs> I don't think anyone ever made it to a million sub. That, that's a crazy number, honestly. Maybe a million subs, like, in total, but... Sheesh! No? Okay, that's Maggie's. Where are you going? Pachoo, pachoo. It's less than 100k consistently. You make it sound like as if it's... It's not good enough. Oh wait, they're actually outside of the zone. Yeah, I don't have the aim for it, so... I don't have the scope for it. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what I'm doing. I excuse you as a sugar daddy. Oh, a rave. An octane, probably. Are they gonna go? I don't think I have the height for it, right? Nope. I think I need to get closer if I want to throw my ult. See if they want to get closer, actually. Oh, they're fighting! Ooh! Ooh, I am- I heard some- Yes, let's go, let's go! Another squad? Can they like run? Huh. I'm recharging. Give me a sec. Recharging shields. Rings next door. I have no idea. Okay, oh well. Ooh. Where the heck? So far away. Drop, drop, drop. Ooh. Yeah, I'm sorry. That was a terrible ult. Oh my god. I, I shouldn't have uh, 
safe there. Ooh. Oh my god, what the heck? Oh my goodness. Dang it. Top five, top five. Good enough. Where's the zone? Oh. <laughs> All right, all right. Dang. Not too shabby, not too shabby. Sheesh. Actually, the games are pretty good. The games I play have been pretty good. But okay. That thing, I promise. I think. Yeah, S. I've got great internet, as you can tell. <laughs> I've got really great internet. Am I back? Am I back? Am I back? Am I back? GG. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. Okay, I'm reconnected. Okay, I'm back. Okay. Yep, yep. I just effed. Um, <laughs> still the same thing. I haven't gone to the toilet. I have a good um, toilet break, you guys. Hydrate. Drink. Everything, you know? Yep. I will go for a very quick break. Burb. Okay, I am back. I am back. Thank you for waiting through the, um, no, no, <laughs> internet issues. Um, my little doggo is just sleeping right at the main door <laughs> because my mom's not at home, <laughs> and so he has no one to like accompany him. Dang. You posted a pic of the cow where you work. <gasps> oh my gosh! Oh my god! The dogs are so cute. The dogs are so cute, and the cow is. Whoa! This cow is. Do they have names? What are their names? Yo, I need to. This is so cute. What else? What else? What else do I have? Other reactions. The dog's not with you anymore. No. Oh man, they are so cute. But you just know that they will go up <laughs> and be like massive ass dogs. <laughs> But thank you for sharing. Mm. 
me see. I don't want to open that up because it's really cute. But for those, let me look at black one with Zoro, white one with your brothers. Ooh. For those who are not, nope, that's not it. I mean, it's technically correct, but <laughs> this is it. This cow. Then it's a little white husky. It's so cute. Then, <gasps> oh my goodness. It looks a little bit bulky. <laughs> this dog, this baby tea for like growing out. <laughs> it's so cute. It's damn cute. But thank you for sharing, Hill. Call the cow Betty. <laughs> she looks so fierce. <laughs> Yes, that was nice. Okay, I'm going to queue into a quick game. While we talk about cows. That's the chocolate milk, right? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Should I play this? Should I play Black Home? Let's play Black Home. I actually do prefer Bangalore's passive more than anything. I think. Actually, Bangalore's a pretty decent character. That we flav flavors favorite? Yes. <laughs> yes. Introducing your champion. This is good. This is good. Let's fight. Ooh, I like the skin. Mang's passive is A to S T M. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I feel like Lova is just one of those that I'm like. <laughs> It's just not it, man. Oh my god, there's so many teams. <laughs> Fuck, we're gonna die, huh? Ah! Buh. Fuck you! Actually, uh oh, someone's here. Huh. We got scanned back. Oh, I don't have enough. That's cool. Nope, nope, nope. Wait, nope. All right. Wait, where are they going? Oh. <laughs> Lower distraction is as <laughs> Oh, they're outside. Okay. Oh, 
Joker. Oh, I would actually die if I went to my... Oh, she's already dead. <laughs> oh well. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Pick up, pick up, pick up. Oh, oh, I'm lagging, I'm lagging. Oh my god, please. Oh my god. Okay, I'm not gonna hide here. <laughs> not bad, not bad. 500 damage, let's go. Um, I'm gonna swap out just in case. Okay, let's go. I say just in case, like as if I'm definitely gonna get more heavy, but I don't know, man. Wait, what do we have? Um, yeah, let's just do that. Um, shield. Ooh, let's go. Backpack here, level one. Let's go. Let's go. Not bad. Not bad. As you can tell, um, I w did not realize that uh, your teammates, <laughs> teammates fire can hurt. <laughs> it's damn dumb, I swear it's really damn dumb. Wait, were there batteries in the box? In the alt? Oh yeah, there are batteries nearby, let's see. Never mind. <laughs> my fat has gone climb. It doesn't hurt me, it slows me down. Oh. Well, I did not notice that at all. Okay, okay. Not quite enough. Um, I think I'm maybe looking for batteries and med kits. But you know what? That work. Cells. Cells are fine. We're still heading in. Can we head in? Yes. I do not want to get caught. I feel. Oh wait, Promenade's not even looted. Huh. What that means, I have no idea. I am in I am in your debt. Ooh. Well, it's just a double tap. I don't think anyone of them yeah, they're not. 
One might be carrying a wingman, so... Let's see, where do they want to get to? Where do they want to go? I think I'll just head down here. Uh, R301. Is anyone want? Hold on to your asses. Enemy has been here? Really? Sound. Blessings upon us. A replicator descends. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Enemy over there. Are we fighting? Yeah, Pumina, yes. let's go. The heck? Wow, you ran really fast. Shush. Ooh, he got weird. Okay, not in this direction, correct. Oh, I did not shield swap. Dang it. Where's our friend? Oh my god, I did not reload. Freaking real! My God, one K damage. That guy was so close to being down. Maybe like fifty HP. I don't know. <laughs> Dang it! Okay, okay. I got a Gibby. Gibby tag. It's not bad. Maybe I'll play. Yeah, I think I'll go back to Bang. <laughs> Still plus XP indeed. Okay. Let's go, let's go. 
Oh no, it's gonna go Bangalore when I want to live in Bangalore. <laughs> okay, let's see. What's this other guy gonna pick? A Sia? Eh, Revenant. Let's go, let's go. Because I was like, I don't want to play lifeline because I would forget to rest. I don't want to play Bloodhound because we have a seer. <laughs> so I'm like, you know what? Rev. Let's just go back to being selfish. <laughs> I'm the jump master, not my first rodeo. Where are we going? Jets, we're dropping hot. Where's this place? Eternal Gardens. Oh, okay. Where are they going? Oh, there is a team. Okay, I'm gonna go further back. Oi. Mastiff? Hmm. What else? What else? What else? Um. Oh, let's go. All right, three hundred one. Let's do wingman then. Is there anything else? What's this? What's this? Oh, I heard someone. Oh, my teammates. <laughs> okay. Where is that team? Like opposite, right? Oh, that direction. <laughs> okay, wrong direction. They're not on there. Nope. Yep, two teams. I'm gonna go. Hmm. Well, they look like a duo, a two stack, so we just wait and see what they think. Well, one person's going, so. <laughs> so you can farm. Thank you for the follow. Oh my goodness. Okay, I'm just gonna pick you up. But thank you for the follow. Oh no! I used it. You know what? This is not open. Okay, I thought this was open. I was scared. But just playing Apex, um, you came at the worst time. Because <laughs> as you can tell, I'm not doing very good. <laughs> oh, that's such a cute emote. That is such a cute emote. That's 25 RP. <laughs> it's fine, I just thought about two weeks ago. I hope you're having fun. Still learning mechanic? Yeah. It is a surprisingly steep learning curve. I don't know. It's one of the more fast paced games. Oh, FPS games that I've played that I'm just a little bit like, ooh, taken aback. Overwatch 2. Oh, we have some Overwatch 2 players in this chat. A number two mod is also in an Overwatch 1 player. And we tried Overwatch 2 
when it came out and yeah we never went back <laughs> we never went back but I hope um, Apex is a little bit gentler on you um, yeah I mean at least Apex you can just mute the shit off people but there are definitely still very crappy people around <laughs> a lot of backseat gamers but you know what I hope I hope you're enjoying Apex What am I gonna play? Can I play Bang? I'm play Bang. Do you have a character that you like playing, Ren? Oh, oh my God! I almost didn't click. Oh my goodness. You like Watson? Dang. As you can tell, I haven't had it unlocked. <laughs> I haven't had it unlocked. Sandra says Watson has really good skins, right? That's the correct one, right? Because she's damn cute. <laughs> I'm still deciding on what character I want to unlock next. I think I'm about 1k points away from unlocking something. You notice all your games so far, your team likes to stay in buildings. <laughs> yes. Yes. And there's like three teams on us, so we're gonna have a lot of fun. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give him the rest. Okay, I'm gonna give him the rest. I'm not gonna. F <laughs> After I stole everything from him, I'm like, oh yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna take the rest. Wait, is he fighting? Is Deadpool fighting? Seems fine. I don't know. Warty's a good camper, yep. Watson and uh, Caustic. Oof. That combo is fucking toxic. Oh, well, for 30 30, I was not paying attention what gun I picked up. <laughs> uh oh, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. How do I. Oh my gosh. Oh. Ah, <laughs> this is impossible. <laughs> this is impossible. She thick. <laughs> Oh, right. Actually, that Spitfire was surprisingly strong. Huh, you know what? Maybe we, maybe we actually don't notice Spitfires um, when I was playing it, even though it's my baby. I love Spitfire for a long period of time. Is it the same guy? It's the same skin? Huh. Might be the same guy. I've got no idea. I just forgot. <laughs> Yeah, I was spawning with Spitty. No it was pretty dang good. Especially if you put in the thermal thing. Spitfire? Spitfire can do that? I thought that's like Rampage or something. It is the same blood, right? You plan to unlock Rampart next? Oh my god. <laughs> I hate Rampart so bad. Yeah, Rampart's a, it's a very good camper. Spitfire has no special anything. Yep. Let's make a choice. Land it's here. just an LMG. It's effectively an LMG. Sheila's very fun. <laughs> okay. 
Are we landing? Oh, ready up. Okay. Spitfire was in the crafter last week, I think. Or like two weeks ago. Wait, where the fuck are we going? Why do we land on such hot spots? Crap! What the heck? He is so low! Oh my god! Oh, it was so low. Fuck you too, man. Fuck you too. God dang it! Come on! It was like what, 165 damage? This fucking dumb. <laughs> hacks, absolutely hacks. How was it the other two? Okay, yep, that's super hot spot. You know what? It's fine. <laughs> oh, it's a bronze one. This is a really, really tough lane. This is a damn tough lane. It's not it. And then our blood's just like casually shopping. <laughs> Man, blood has so much loot. I should have landed near near blood. So, this is tough. 165! 165 damage! Man. Okay. 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 I hate... I hate the lens. It's so tough. Why? Why do people land like that? Like, I get... <laughs> it is way too intense. It's way too intense. An alchemist? Oh! <gasps> Oh, that's damn cute! Oh, I love this, but I don't use an Eva 8 that often. Gibby stat, any Prowler skin? Huh! Not terrible. Quite cute skin, right? Okay, what else, what else do I get? Oh, no. <laughs> I actually wonder if I should unlock like Catalyst or Vagrant slash Vantage. Yo, this reef is cool. Or maybe I should unlock Fuse. I think Fuse would be quite fun. I've got everything you need. But I feel like Fuse, I need to remind myself to use my bombs. <laughs> no we should play so you can carry me to Diamond. <laughs> you mean I um, drop you to, to, to Bronze? <laughs> <laughs> it's the same blood. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, okay. High blood for the third time. <laughs> Fated to be with the blood. Uh huh, uh huh. <laughs> oh my god. This is not it. This is not it. Oh, the Sakura place. I actually really like this, but only for the tree. I like the tree. The tree is very pretty. Oh, this might be an actually decent land. There's no one. Let's go. We can finally get some... Some loot before we die. Provided guns actually spawn. <laughs> What is up with guns? Okay, there we go. Flatline. Not bad, not bad. Charge. I don't want to play a charge. Mm. I will play a wingman for the time being, and then we'll see. 
I'm not. Oh, you know what? Uh, I don't want two by four. It's too much. Flat. Okay, let me find another. Another circle. Another loot area. Yeah, you know what? Thanks. Oh. Rooms next door. Forty-five. You know what? I should just carry the light in case I see an R301. I would love an R301. Charge a charge is S tier. Kind of agree. So far away. Oh, I was expecting it to be a lot nearer. <laughs> okay, okay, I have one stack left. Let's go, let's go. Oh, it's so far away. It is so far away. I'm just gonna keep. Mm. I'm just gonna do one more stack. Should I? Should I? Should I? Should I? You know what? 220 is enough. I can do with one more stack of heavy, and I think that's it. Okay, where do we want to go? Ooh, 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 it's here. <laughs> Oops. I don't think I can climb this. Ugh. Sniper mag. <laughs> I have an extended sniper mag here. Level three. Wait, who's playing sniper? Oh, blood harness. Oh, anyway, <laughs> I don't know where they wanna go. Let's see. Is number two mod still working? It's eleven. <laughs> I wasn't looking. <laughs> Is number two mod still working? Thank you. It's like eleven thirty. Number two mod. Stop working. Yo, that's a really nice. Ooh, look at that knife. Oh my god, number two mod. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you go to the office today? Aren't you tired? It's not it, man. You need to take care of yourself. You say that we're gonna have desserts. Tomorrow, but <laughs> you're just overworking us out. Map shows we're spread out a lot. You got smoke. Hostile that is smoke. Oh, there's definitely a team there. <laughs> Enemy spotted. You have to go for the next three days. Let's just. <laughs> Let's just stream and not go for dinner. <laughs> Wait, where's blood? Did blood just like DC? Did blood like notice that I'm the same, like with, like like he, like he's playing with the same same person, and so he's like, I, I don't wanna play with you anymore. Let's <laughs> reposition there. <laughs> but when 
that are washroom. <laughs> you and Rave's like, no you, no you. <laughs> Oh, blood's back. <laughs> okay. Let's go, let's go. Should be behind us, right? I would imagine they'll be camping up like the big building. So I'm gonna have a fun time going up. <laughs> Need one, one more, one more, one more, another almost, <laughs> two more, <laughs> one more. <laughs> med kit here. I have an extended sniper mag here, level three. Okay, I can't, I can't do light. No, we can't, we can't keep Red doing this. Like he campers, so I think so too. All right, uh, well, Rave is up there already. <laughs> Oh, they, they didn't. Gotta hop up here. Thank you. You got it. You got it. No, oh, there's definitely people up here, right? Half the squads are left. Let's smoke them. No one's here? Interesting. Heard that. Arch star out. Hostile spotted. Oh my gosh. That guy's crafting? Are you for real? <laughs> oh, it hurt no one. Oh, dang. Okay. That's a great. Come in, come in, come in. Oh. ready for it we just weren't ready for it that is okay that is absolutely okay that was some really good smoke so i think wait maybe some of them had digital threats as i was a damn confident push into the smoke <laughs> Trigger. Just make sure you know why. I don't trust elevators. 
Yeah, smoke. Yep. Okay, question. Are you guys getting for for those who are celebrating Chinese New Year <laughs> or Lunar New Year? Are you guys getting snacks? I'm thinking. Well, I guess we will get some snacks, but. I don't know. We actually don't eat a lot of snacks over Chinese New Year. And although I do like a few classic Lunar New Year snacks, but not a lot. Oh, I'm Jump Master. You stack on potato chips? Nice, I like that. Um, I don't know where that is, but... <laughs> Let's just go. We might be dropping a little bit late, but it's okay. Yeah, we're dropping a little bit late. Let's go that way. Okay. Oh my god, some of them already has shit. Shit! No, there was shit land, there's shit land! Very nice, very nice. Ooh! Oh my god! Okay. That was... <laughs> that was not it. That was not it. Okay. Let's go. I want to climb to silver too. I want to climb to silver too. Let's go. Let's do it. Ooh, this lifeline is... The costume is very nice. I like it. It's time to impress. We got this round squared away. I've got everything you need. I'm burping, I'm sorry. Why? Why am I burping so much? I only had tortilla pizza. That's it. Stay on me. I'm the jump master. No, no, no. It's time. I'm the jump master. Dropping in. Hang on. I say we move there. Oh my god! It was street dropping. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's then here. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on. What's this? Vault? Ooh, vault. Vault, 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 vault. Not a hairbox. Not a hairbox. Please. Eh, nothing else? Okay, let's just see if I can loot here before I get shot. I didn't even go fight. That's, that's a little fast. Maybe the pizza has air. <laughs> Sounds about right. Wait, wait. 
Okay, they're actually gonna go fight. Okay, I'm gonna go. Oh yeah, that's true. I had cabbage for lunch. Is that supposed to be gassy? Uh oh. I need to stay with them. Uh oh. You know what? Let's go. Hi, yeah. That's a little fast. You know what? Banner is pretty cute. Mm. Come on. Come on. I just need a, a good game. A, a good, good game. <laughs> good game. I'm just like slightly hungry. Why am I hungry? <laughs> Why am I? <laughs> right, feline, stop working. Come help me, Rain. <laughs> Dude, he makes the game so much harder because of his rank and because of his skill level that I I, I die a lot more than I should. <laughs> I'm a little hungry, but in 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 the like. I, I just have an itchy mouth kind of situation. This is gonna be a good fight. Okay, let's do blood. Oh, okay, don't come. <laughs> he will be summoned. Ooh, I like the background. It's actually very nice. This life is cool. Get ready. I'm coming for you, friend. <laughs> Hello, second place more. <laughs> I'm still working, second place mod. You have to go to office tomorrow. Yeah, you need to go sleep. Where are you going? Where are you going? What's this? Straight down? Are you for real? We're going straight down? I promenade. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. Yeah, this is not it, man. Fuck, bro. Fuck. Yep, this is not it. <laughs> this, this is not it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay, she might die. Oh my god, there's just so many people! So many people! Man, I couldn't get to any loot. It sucks. Her banner is really fancy. You know that there's probably someone who's, who spends money. <laughs> Look at all of this good loot. Oh my gosh. I want that, I want that loot. 
So anyway, I think I have like 40 seconds, 30 seconds before I die. So... <laughs> What's up, guys? Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, I timed out. Okay. Let's go. Let's see, let's see, let's see. What am I gonna play? Am I gonna play Bangalore? Bangalore. The fight ain't over until we win it. Okay, let's see. Oh, I actually have three games that I bought that I've not played yet. I'm looking at it right now. There's Bones Cafe, there's Ori and the Will of the Wisps, which is a platformer. And I think it's gonna suck. Like, I, I'm gonna suck at it, because it's a platformer. <laughs> and then Dark Side Detective, which is like a storytelling kind of thing. Like, a, it's solve mysteries and it's a... I don't know if it's scary. Hmm. Here we go. I'm the jump master. Never turn your back on Gibraltar. Show us later? Sure, if I remember. <laughs> Number two mod. Number one mod says um, she'd rather you don't on the stream and finish up your work. And we're going to promenade. Let's go. Oh my god. Fight, 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 fight. What the fuck? There's nothing! Smoke out. Give me something to fight! Okay, you know what? Sure. <laughs> Fight. Fight. Why? Why do people love hot drops so much? Okay, you know what? Minus 24. That's not too bad, right? <laughs> That is one less than minus twenty five. <laughs> Crap. Come on, give me someone who doesn't drop hot drops, please. Ooh, this is a nice skin. I love this. This looks familiar. Have I played her before? I hope not. <laughs> I was just the same skin, and that's it. Bank. Wait, no, I think it's the same group of people. Why is it always the same group of people? Right? This is the same group of people. No, wait. This Bangalore just... I love it. You know what? That's, that's not the same background. But Bangalore feels very familiar. I <laughs> Okay. I will jump. I don't know where I'll jump, but I will jump. 
Let's lend this. I think this looks hot. Hot as fuck. GG, have fun. You always jump the end of far left and right. Yep. I would do that too. But sometimes people just rage. Uh oh, uh oh. oh. <laughs> you know what? No. Not terrible, not terrible. Run? There's no such thing as run. <laughs> I see. As I freaking die to something else. Come on, come on, come on. Sounds like he might still be near, but there's nothing... Wait, did he not drop with them? Healing. Watch my back. Okay. Oh well. Um, what do I need? What do I need? What do I need? Uh, a new gun, hopefully. <laughs> a different gun. Uh, more light ammo, please. Shit, 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 no! I uh... Oh no, that was, that was not good, that was not good. Oh, thank you, thank you. Oh no. Please give me something. <laughs> Please. I'm in. Sheesh. Okay. Um. You know what? Hmm, I suppose take this right. Play around legends in their firing range, see their skills. Hmm. Yeah, that's that's a, that's a good thing to do. Okay, I think I need to swap out. Um, there's no way. Nope, never mind. I I just lost the energy. <laughs> oh, actually, that's way too many. Um, I'm gonna drop this just so that I can get some extra slots for light. Yours, extra supplies. Oui. Okay, I need a new... Okay, let's go find another different kind of gun. Um... You think Ref needs a buff? I feel like even if Ref gets a buff, no one will really play him. But if Ref gets a buff, what do you think his buff should be? What should it entail?
Ooh, another one. Eh. Rev needs a whole rework. <laughs> what the heck? Big hitbox and ultimate hut to coordinate. His Q is not that intimidating. Okay. Actually, fair. Hmm. Actually, fair. Ooh. It's only what? Ooh. ooh. Hey, oi! No! Oh my god! Dang it! Okay, I should have. I should have picked up a wingman. That was terrible. Snare needs a buff because 25 seconds is too long. Oh, do you mean the queue is too long for Rev? I'm thinking it should deal damage like Maggie's Q, taking slowly. Okay. Ash ulti is pretty much like Wraith but one way. <laughs> Ash Q's recharge time. 25 seconds is too long, really. But the snare, doesn't it hurt you if you... hurt the shields if you snare at someone? Like apart from like concussion and all that and slowing, concussion slowing down that kind of stuff. A snare is not very strong. Ash ulti, if I was on losing battle, I'd be the one running this one. <laughs> Interesting. A passive is situational. Do you guys think that there is a like top tier character? I know Sandra has for Bangalore, right? An A to an S in terms of her skills and her passive her skills, her ults. What other characters do you guys feel is like top tier in terms of the Q, the passives, and the ults? Horizon? Okay. If there are constant third parties, the passive has little to no use. Okay. But I've heard that Horizon's ult is weakened, right? Like it's easier to shoot down now. Volk is still viable. I don't really like Volk's ult though. Like, it's it's a little bit too slow and not very helpful in very tense situation. Okay, are we just like passing it back and forth? We're just like passing book? Passing the book? Um... No, if you don't want to jump, I'm gonna jump. Oh, I almost phased through it. A 
30-30. No, I don't want a 30-30. Okay, where else? Okay, okay, that's fair. In, in the storm point. Oh, actually, no, I don't need... Double tap trigger. Okay, if I can find an Eva, I might just do a double tra double tap trigger. Actually, right, if I have so much heavy, that's what, three stacks? I'm gonna hold on first and I'm gonna see if I can find something else. Now I'm gonna swap out. Well, I don't want P2020. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> P2020 has run its time. Does that make sense? Hmm. New kill leader. Um, an L star. Dang, I. Ooh. I'm gonna swap this. Where are they? Okay, they're there. Also, Puff can be really OP if they give him some other passive. Mmm. Okay, I, I should stop taking heavy. I don't have another heavy. Um. Dude, I had a. Never mind. Uh, hemlock. No, I don't. Okay. Uh, GG. Have fun. <laughs> I have barely any bullets in a lot of things. I don't think Pathy has any other passive except scanning the beacon. Incoming hmm. care package. Pro tip, don't try intercepting something at Mach 1. Interesting, interesting. I don't want to die here. Please don't let me die here. Right, let me just lose one stack. Full stack. Um, yeah, I'll need that. Uh, this one. Uh, what's this? What do I not have? Oh, never mind. <laughs> Let me lose another stack. Oh, wow, they're traveling damn far. Oh, I think they're going for a care package or something. More check here. A flat killer. It's a bit tough. I'm just gonna swap out. Um, okay. <gasps> oh, nope. Huh. You know what? It's fine. I'll just carry this for a while. Um, I'm still looking. Four, R3. Let's go R3. Maybe they feel that Pathy's balanced grapple covers whatever his passive lacks. Life used to be real OP. Arrest you can Yeah, I heard about that. And then they nerfed her like crazy. <laughs> um, no, we're not gonna do that yet. Is there anything good up here? Helmet here. Oh, I have a shit shield. Got an extended sniper mag here. Level four. Um. Evo shield here. Level two. Got a hop up here. Double tap trigger. Okay, I'm going to swap out a shield. Is there an R301? Somewhere. Actually an R99. You know what? Let's just go for an R99. It's a little wilder, but it's okay. Why didn't no one get his bats? Okay. They reworked her abilities for Jackson. 
Jackson's alt can sometimes work on Horizon's Q. Okay. Oh, extra supplies over here. Then our 301. I'm gonna go get it. There's nine squads left and we have not met anyone else. <laughs> Have I seen Jackson's ult? Is that his, um, castle thingy? Like the huge shields? Or are you talking about the one where he can pull people? No, actually, that's necessarily his ult. Okay, they're moving really fast. Oh yeah, he does, he does, he does jump. He jumps in the air and then... <laughs> this is a surprisingly unfruitful... ...game. Is this how I'm gonna climb rank? <laughs> what the heck? I think they played with the idea of movement with the newer legends. Thanks. Maybe it should. No, lifeline. Lifeline doesn't need a gold shoe, right? She would need a gold backpack. That would be more useful. Go armor, I mean. Then Vantage's Q is Octane's pet. Oh. Vantage needs a nerf, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's a freaking nerf, man. I hate her ult so much. Her ult is so unnecessarily painful, and the fact that you can get downed by the second time. I don't even recall like, what's the recharge or the... Or the number of bullets she has. But, man. Chain missing eyes. <laughs> Okay. Where are we going? She's not a popular legend. Hmm. Oh. I'm not gonna take it. She should, she should have even take it, and I'm gonna take an extra one. Okay. Where is everybody? It's like nine squads left and we have not seen anyone else. What the heck? What the heck? Rave was a very OP legend. Oh, more OP than she is now? She used to be the horizon. <laughs> Wait, she's also fighting someone else? Oh shit. Am 
Well, I didn't hurt anyone. So that kind of sucks. Wait, no. Hi, yo. Oh no. Ice. What is that? <laughs> Dang it. I was trying my best to hurt as many people as I can. Volk's passive is OP because of her wings. Mm. Minus. What the, what the heck? What the you? Okay. Wings that help her move around. Hmm. I think maybe it's because I've not played Volk before. I'm very meh towards Volk as a character. I think her ult is like okay, okay. Watson? Okay, let's do let's do Watson. Spent gunpowder. Smells like victory. She used to be the horizon. I am prepared for <laughs> Introducing your champion. Hey, I'm the jump master. Ow. Ready up. Burn up, burn up. Study the land. Find our advantage. Then we jump. Then we jump. I say we land here and for battle. Ooh. Let's see how many teams are there going to be. Two? One? The other team's not going? Huh. One. Maybe. Oh, they're maybe gonna go to the bottom. Enemy uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. That's that's not a good land. <laughs> Crap. Swap. There's no way I'm playing a wing. Oh my god. I apologize. I did not mean to. <laughs> uh oh. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, that's not the right direction. Wait a second. Huh? Whoa, that's so many death boxes. Sheesh. Okay, no. Come on, is there somewhere that I can swap? Reloading. 
No, 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 no. No, my god, my aim. <laughs> oh, my aim was terrible. Okay, come on, lifeline, 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 lifeline. Lifeline, lifeline. Oh my god, there's so many teams. Lifeline, don't go out, please. <laughs> come on, come on, man, come on. Okay, never mind, never mind. If that's the case. Yeah. Crap. Nope, 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 that's not it. I need a different... Shit, how is it no good? <laughs> okay, okay. Come on, pick yourself up. Pick yourself up. Okay, okay. Not 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 terrible. Not terrible. Um, you know what? Doesn't matter. Ooh, let's go. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Seems like I got it under control. Um, I think. <laughs> I think. Is this heavy? Yes. They are upstairs. They are upstairs. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. Oh, I did not. Oh no. Oh my god. Okay. No! Oh my god! There's way too many teams! There's way too many teams! What the heck? We just walked straight into fire! <laughs> we could not even get out of it! Okay, you know what? Good enough, good enough. Class 25? <laughs> Slow and steady wins the race, huh? Actually, this might be LG for me because we're going to have a 10 a.m. stream tomorrow. Um, <laughs> I hope. <laughs> Real men use iron so yeah, I use heavy artillery. I'm going to have a 10 a.m. stream. I'm going to play some games and then, yeah, that's it. We're going to play some games. <laughs> Hydrate, guys. Ba -da -ba. I'm the jump master. Ready up. Avocados from Mexico? alive when rapidly approaching my death. Okay, okay. Let's go. Let's go. There are three teams. Fuck. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. 
Oh my god. No! Come on! Oh yes! Oh, that's another team. Oh, that's not Oh my god. <laughs> what is this? This is not it. Damn it, that was so close. No 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 no. This, this, this is this is not the official LG. This this is not it. We can't end on 20 out of 20. What the heck? And I can unlock a new legend, but I'm not gonna do it today. Cause it's it's too much. <laughs> what the heck? Okay. Actual LG. If this game <laughs> sucks ass, <laughs> that's it. That's it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my god, I just realized that my <laughs> my Discord logging. It's still logging in the wrong channel. Oh my god. Okay, okay, okay. I need to get that fixed. But thanks for joining Discord, guys. Um as you can tell, uh <laughs> there's a lot of other things I'm still getting fixed, I guess. Um but Let me think. Did I put it in the wrong place? Hmm. Give me a moment. I am taking the time to just look through what the heck is going on. Oh my god, oh that's why, that's why. Um Okay, I'm gonna play Bangalore. Logs, 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 logs. Um I do not wait for inspiration. I take it. Logs, 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 logs. Where do I want it? Logs. Okay. Yep. That's fixed. Okay. Let me actually just remove these. Rules are still very important. Thank you very much. <laughs> Man, Carl, you should not have permission here. I apologize if the stream is a little stuttery because I'm kind of off. Um, Kind of off it, so that's why I'm not on the game. That's why I meant. <laughs> but okay, okay, okay. This, this should be settled. This should be settled. The heat of the flame calls to us all. Okay. How are there still so many teams at the back? Oh, dang. <laughs> Dip. Let's check out that area. Wait, we're actually gonna go there? That's a little bit of a late land, right? Okay, I don't like this at all. Double tap trigger. Oh, actually, no one's here, okay. That's good, that's good. Deploy health drone? Huh? Ooh, let's go. You like Pathfinder's voice line at the legend selection scene. Hmm. Uh, you've got good taste. That's all. I don't want a prowler. Oh, actually, then maybe I do this. Wait. Nope, 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 nope. I need this. Uh. Oh no, actually I don't like this. 
I don't like it to be too zoomed in. Let's go. The one that says today smells like victory. I love pretending to smell. Sniff, sniff. <laughs> oh man. Oh, he took it, huh? <laughs> Okay, okay. I need a bag, so uh, that will be good. Mushy, mushy. Puffy just feels like a very innocent person. But yeah, Puffy does spread joy. Okay, I'm gonna do this. What else? Um. See what I want to play. Um. Ooh. Ooh. Actually, yeah, flatline. Let's just do that. Got an Evo shield here, level three. What's my? Fuck, fuck, fuck. What do I want to do? Uh. Yep. Oh wait. Never mind. It got joined. <laughs> God dang. Okay, that's fine. Where are we going? Hmm, I don't want to draw. Should I? Is this too many shotgun shells? Sixteen, sixty four, yes. Okay, I need. Stringers? Why am I not picking up stringers? Do I not see stringers? Okay, I'm gonna go to that extra supply bin thing. Huh. Okay, I guess not. That line, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I guess I don't need um. <laughs> I steal stuff. Oh, dick! Like ammo magazine. Okay. I have no idea. <laughs> <laughs> um. Nope. Flatty looking pretty ready to shred some dudes. Yo, yo. No, oh, he has a charge. Okay. Life one has a charge. Not too bad, not too bad. That's unlooted. More loot, let's go. Sniper ammo. I don't know. Ooh. Ooh. But I have a flat. You know what? I'm just going to keep the flat. I think, just in case, <laughs> just in case. Extended light magazine here, level two. Dibs. Dibs. Oh, he's gonna go take it, huh? Oh, <laughs> okay, I guess not. Thank you. Tell me when we win, you hear me? Yes. Do 
Okay. I'm just gonna collect a ooh. Ooh. I didn't realize you could put a digital on an Eva eight. Wow, I've never tried that. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, I'm gonna pick up the batteries or not. I'm not with them. Lifeline wants to fight. Wow, purple shield. Oh, actually, this outside of the zone. Do we actually want to fight this? Oh, but I'll f Kendrick's not coming. Hurt someone. I actually don't know if I want to fight this stem. Because it is a little bit. Over there. Let's go this way. Yeah, they went the other direction. Come on, life. Scouting for gear here. I could. Oh no, life is going the other direction. Come on, life, don't get pinched, don't get pinched. Yep, that's what I thought. Far, way too far. Yeah, this is not it. That's Only not okay. <laughs> okay. Yup. There we go. They're fighting. Let's go. Yeah, there's no way I'm getting his tab banner like that. Got a live one out there. Opening fire. Running from the fight, idiots. Yeah. I'm taking fire. <laughs> he just left. Damn it! Ooh, dang. Okay, yep. Hey, Alright, top five without doing anything. Let's go. <laughs> it is such a real last game. The first split. When is it gonna occur? Um, I, I wanna I wanna say it's like six p.m. 
because usually that's when a lot of our dailies refresh. But second place mod would be a best to answer this. I'm just guessing that split's happening at 6 p.m. today, Tuesday. A weird LG. <laughs> Yo. At least I got positive RP, so that's good. But yeah, that is it for today. You think it's tomorrow, 11 p.m.? Okay, there you go. Um, he is the one with like hundreds of hours on Apex, so... <laughs> Let's see... Ten AM PT, one PM ET. I have no idea. <laughs> okay, I'm leaving the game. At one AM. Okay. <laughs> so, <laughs> so it is uh six PM, eleven PM, and one AM. <laughs> oh no, no, it's two AM. Yeah, we have no idea. Basically, uh, GMT six PM, you plus eight hours, so Singapore time, ish. Yeah. Sure. Um, <laughs> but yeah, that is it for today's stream. Thank you guys so much for joining. Um, supposedly in 1.5 hours. That is fair. Yes. 1.5 hours. <laughs> but yeah, um, socials, that's a Discord community. If you like, to join if you've joined thank you for joining i hope you enjoy talking to the community <laughs> it is very very new like it literally just launched today and that's why there's a lot of little things that i'm trying to like fix and all that but but yeah um that is it not 1.5 i mean if it's 2 a.m wait but it's 17 january you know what? I'm not going to do the math. It's okay. <laughs> Thank you for streams. Thank you for joining, Ren. 17 gen. Yes. 24 plus 1.5 hours. So Wednesday, uh, 2 a.m. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> We're really good at this, huh? But yeah. Um... Tomorrow slash today's stream, Tuesday's stream will be 10 a.m. SG time. That's GMT plus 8. Because <laughs> time zones are really weird, but... We are having a night stream. Yes, Wednesday we're having a night stream. Um, Tuesday will be a morning stream, which is later on. Um, so I guess I'll see you guys in like nine and a half hours <laughs> if, you're, if you're gonna join in. Um, stream schedule is on Discord if you have joined Discord. Feel free to go and take a look. Feel free to browse through Discord. Um, if there's anything that you'd like to, you know, suggest and all that, feel free. We'll be happy to take a look at it and see if, if we can implement it. Wednesday is when new split occurs. Yes, that I'll be able to stream and play it. Yes, correct. <laughs> but yes. I will see you guys tomorrow in 10 hours. Um, yeah, thank you guys so much for joining. Let me change my scene. But yeah, that's it. GG's. Uh, have a good sleep if it's nighttime for you. If not, have a good day if it's daytime for you. Bye.